right, what's up, y'all? Welcome to Game Day with Heavy Cardboard, where we teach, play, and discuss medium and heavy strategy board games, war games, 18xx. And today is two years in the making. We're really excited to feature a pipeline designed by Ryan Courtney and published by Capstone Games. And I'd feel remiss if I didn't give a shout out to Ian O'Toole, who did really amazing artwork in this. All right. So Capstone Games also very kindly provided us with this prototype copy of Pipeline and sponsored the playthrough. So many thanks to Clay and everybody over at Capstone Games. And by everybody, I mean Clay and Ashley. So yeah. thanks a lot for that. <laughs> so welcome everybody watching live around the world as well as after the fact. I'm your host, Edward Euler. Happy to be joined today by some members of the herd. Jess. Andrew. Got him. All right. So before we start, a big thanks to all 740 patrons who helped make this possible. Today, especially want to give a shout out to the rabbi, Philip M., who I saw is in chat. Say thanks for being a patron and supporting the show. So Pipeline. I said it was two years into making. The reason I said that is, in fact, two years next week, I will have played my first time playing this. I played a prototype of this with uh, Clay and Tommy from Meeple Realty and... I think maybe Amanda, I can't remember, or it was, anyway, we played the prototype of it, and the game obviously has changed some, but it still feels very much like what that prototype I played, and coming away from that, I was really excited for this game, so yes, normally we don't do a roundtable discussion after it's sponsored playthroughs, we're gonna tonight, because let's face it, I've been excited about this game for two years, if you followed me on Twitter or the show or anything, I've talked about this game a whole, whole lot. I'm really stoked to be able to show this to you. That said, it did just start on Kickstarter today. I uh, Likely the artwork is close to being done. Component-wise, I know we're still going to change some of the colors on the uh, components that we have are a little bit off. So keep in mind, it is a prototype. This is not a finished copy. That said... I'm ready to rock and roll. Are you guys excited? Yes. yes. Yep. All right, cool. Uh, yeah, so let's go ahead. Uh, also, I am going to take the chat and the cameras down for the teach as I want to do normally, and then I will bring everything back up once we get started. So that said, let's go ahead, dig into Pipeline, all right? So in Pipeline, kind of a high-level overview. Over the course of three years, each successive year being shorter and shorter, Players are going to be purchasing or otherwise acquiring up to three different types or colors of oil, holding them in their tanks over on their tableaus. From there, they're going to be refining that oil through their own network of pipelines. And to show you guys what that's going to look like, something along the lines of this. So they're going to be refining that oil through their own network of pipelines that they'll have built to bring it from crude oil up to low to mid or possibly high grade oil to either then sell it to the refined markets, fulfill recurring contracts, or one-time orders. The money that players are going to be spending and hopefully gaining also doubles as victory points, which will be tallied along with some end game scoring after three years. Whoever has the most money at the end of the game wins. So normally what I would do at this point is go over the entire board, what it is that you guys are looking at. There is a ton of information out here, but I'll be honest, instead of doing that, I'm just going to hit on a couple things and then touch on the rest as I teach the game. So in the top right hand corner, we have the round track, which is broken up into three years. Then we have the turn order track there in the middle. And pretty much everything else I'm going to go ahead and go over when I'm describing the actions and what the game is about, and what you're trying to do. So as previously said, the game is played over three years, eight rounds in the first year, six in the second, and finally four in the last year. In each round, players are going to take one turn in existing player order. Each turn comprises two phases. You have a work phase and then a machine phase. And all that is laid out right here on our player boards, which will cover as the game goes along. After each player has taken their turn, the round marker moves to the next space on the round track. There's a refresh phase at the beginning of the second and third year, but we'll cover that later. On each player's work phase, the player will move their one worker or meeple 
to take one of available 10 actions. You have to have enough cash to be able to perform the action to be able to go there. There's no blocking of actions. Each action is open to each player regardless if other players have taken their wanted action previously. If a player takes one of the eight available actions that are on the quote-unquote cross in the center of the board, they may elect to pay $10 to the bank and take the associated secondary action. And by associated, I mean basically whatever shares the arm of that cross. That is the secondary available action. After that, if a player took one of the four actions that also has the change order or change turn order symbol, regardless if they did so as a main or secondary action, they may affect turn order, but we'll cover that later. So basically, you're going to take one of 10 actions. If it's one of the eight that's on the cross, you can pay 10 bucks to take the action next to it. And if you took one of the actions that has the change order, you can change the turn order. Boom. Easy. All right. Pretty simple. High overview of it there. Now let's go over what the 10 available actions are. So first off, we have the crude market. So to be able to do that, we're gonna move our meeple or our worker onto the crude market. And then this is one of the, place, one of the places that players may purchase and sometimes sell crude oil in all three colors or three types of oil. This, I should point out that the colors and type of oil, that's basically, I'm gonna use those terms interchangeably. Same with cube and oil barrel. It's the exact same thing, okay? Players are only limited in their selling to the available open spaces in the market, i.e. if there's open spaces, they can fill them and sell however many as they have. And they're only limited in buying to their available tanks on their player boards. So for instance, down here, the available spaces on their player board. All selling takes place prior to any buying, and to purchase crude oil, pay the total amount shown above each barrel of the oil to the bank, take the barrel, place it on an available crude oil tank on your board. Pretty simple. To sell crude oil, place a barrel from the tank here, place it onto an open space, and get that amount of money. Real simple, right? Note, all oil can always be sold or used as a lower quality than what it is but you only get paid for the quality needed or requested. Think of it as this way. I'm sure your customers are always going to be happy to receive higher quality oil than what they paid for, right? Kind of makes sense, right? Higher grade gas. Think of it that way, but at a discounted price, all right? Also, you always buy the cheapest oil and you always sell to the most expensive. So if I were selling low grade oil, I would sell for the 30 versus the 25 if I were selling blue low grade oil, okay? All right. So that's the crude market. Now let's go ahead and move on to the other th or three more actions, which are the refined markets. Refined market one, two, and three. If you go over to any of them, then they functionally, they're the same as the crude market and all three refined markets also function the same as one another. This is also one of the players, one of the places that players may purchase and sell crude and low, mid, and high grade oil, various colors and types of oil. So refined market one refers to this area only. So you would only be able to purchase green crude and refined orange and gray. And for instance, refined market two changes as does three, okay? Again, players are only limited in selling and buying based on what they have that's out here spaces wise, as well as what they have in their available tanks. All right. So any questions on the refined markets? No. Okay. Pretty simple. So again, we have the crude down here that also matches the crude market up here, but we have the crude here. We have low grade orange and blue, mid grade orange and blue and high grade orange and blue. Okay, cool. Then let's move over to contracts and loans. So if I were to go to contracts and loans, obviously place my worker on there. Even though it's not a Martin Wallace game, there are loans and you're allowed to take one loan per action. Each loan, 15 bucks and comes with a penalty cube. All right. So these penalty cubes though, have an increasing cost at the end of the game and there is no way to get rid of them. A loan or two is fine, and I should also point out that unfulfilled contracts can also grant 
penalty cubes. So be careful taking too many. And I want to go ahead and point out down here, it shows the chart. So as you get penalty cubes, you're going to be putting them down here and they go up in cost prohibitively. Ryan has said, basically, if you stay on the left-hand side of the column, you still have a chance. If you make it to the right side, it doesn't look good for the home team. All right. So contracts and loans. So we talked about loans, 15 bucks, get a penalty cube, pretty simple. However, contracts, you may select up to three contracts, one from each of the three rows. Contracts are free and there's no limit to the number of contracts that a player may have. However, upon selecting a contract, player must decide if it's either an active or a deferred contract. So let's go ahead and show the tableau. So up here would be where the deferred go and the active contracts will go over to the right hand side. If you choose to make it an active contract, it must be fulfilled each year. So if I place it here and say it's an active contract, it must be fulfilled every year, including the current year and every subsequent year. You place it over here to the right, right? If the contract is fulfilled each year, it remains active. So I will have to fulfill it in the second and third year or just the third year if I got it during the second year, right? However, if it's not fulfilled, it's removed from the game and, oh yes, my good friend, penalty cube comes with it. So I would not only lose that, but I also get another penalty cube. However, if I choose to make it a deferred contract, it doesn't have to be fulfilled until the following year and possibly a subsequent year, depending on what year I took it. Place it in deferred contract area on your player board. Pretty simple there. Okay. Any questions on contracts and loans? The payout? How do they pay out? Uh, those I will get to in a little bit. Okay, cool. All right. So also I should point out, it does have the turn uh, change turn order. So let's go ahead and explain that now. So if on my turn, I took the contracts and loans or I took the refined market and then paid the 10 bucks for the secondary action, meaning I took the contracts and loans, then I get to manipulate turn order. I could keep it exactly where I'm at, but you know what? Maybe I say I wanna go forth. Cool, great. Then Jess comes along and she does something that also affects turn order. She says, you know what? Sorry, Edward. I want to go last. Okay. So she can bump me out and go last. So in other words, if you're last in turn order, you get last licks. If you take one of these four actions to be able to manipulate turn order, maybe you want to go first, maybe you want to go last, et cetera, et cetera. So the only way is if you take one of those four of the 10 actions. Cool. All right. So let's go ahead and keep moving on now. And let's go over to the tanks and pipes area. So if over here, tanks and pipes. So pretty simple. You're going to be purchasing, wait for it, tanks and or pipes. Okay. So you can purchase any number of tanks for the cost shown. And with this being a four player game, all the tanks are filled, three player game, two player game, etc. So you can purchase any amount of tanks. And when you purchase tanks, you can put them wherever you want. The column does not matter where the tanks go. However, the row does, whether you want it a tank for crude, mid, low, or low, mid, or high grade oil. Okay. Each tank can hold up to two barrels of oil on it. All right. And also, I should point out that oil can go straight from crude to high grade oil, potentially without tanks in between, but we'll cover that later. Okay. In addition to that, it is tanks and pipes. You can purchase pipes to be able to build your own personal network of pipes. However, the cost, you can buy either two for 15 or four for 40, which is more expensive than the main area on the board, but we'll talk about that part later. When you purchase pipes, and you can only purchase when you go to the tanks and pipes area, when you purchase them from here, you immediately must add them to your personal pipe network. Once a tile is placed, it can never be moved or changed. And when adding pipe tiles to your personal pipe network, the new tiles must connect to at least one, exact, one existing tile orthogonally. So I could something like this. It basically must share a side of one existing pipe or one existing tile, I should say, like so could do something like that. That's okay as well. However, the first tile that you place obviously is exempt from that rule. Okay. So any questions about placing pipe? 
Okay, wow, we're humming right along. Mm -hmm. All right, cool, all right. Tiles can be rotated in any direction, but they have to end up, like I said, sharing a side with one existing tile. And when you add multiple tiles, I also should show that. When you add multiple tiles, if let's say I'm adding these two, I could do one here and I could add one over here. They do not have to attach the new tiles to one another, okay, as an example, okay? And then just like the others, you can change turn order after taking the action. Any questions on tanks and pipes? No. Okay, machines and pipes, which go there and that is here. That is, you can purchase any number of machines for the cost shown and you can add again or purchase two to four pipes as well on that. The exact same system works. However, you might be asking yourself, so. what are machines? Well, machines enable the player to be able to run pipelines connected to them at the end of their turn during the machine phase. So if I purchase the machine and I choose to put it down here and I'll explain why I might choose to put it down there later, there, you place it immediately onto any pipe tile in their personal pipe network and it must cover half of an existing tile. So I could do something like this, like this, etc., all the way around anywhere I want, okay? More on that later. Any questions on machines and pipes, at least the purchasing of them? Cool? All right. Now, the last of the eight main actions are the upgrades. Let me draw your attention to this part of the board, or off board as it were, here. You place your worker on the upgrade action. You can purchase up to two available upgrades and the cost, 20 bucks a piece. They are in three levels. There are three level ones, one level two, one level three. You, If you want to buy a level two, you must already have a level one of the upgrade to be able to purchase it. So you purchase, let's say for instance, immediately receive two government pipe tiles. That's nice. Yearly, receive one government pipe tile. I pay 20 bucks to the bank, I take that. I take one of the markers and I say, oh, no one else can buy those, any of those upgrades for the rest of the year. But wait, there's more. Not only can nobody buy that, if I choose optionally, <laughs> I can then select to say, you know what? No one's gonna be able to buy those either. Or maybe those. Those are just because, not really. I asked Ryan why he put this in the game and he said, honestly, it's because Otherwise, to be able to block it, you would have to run straight up that row. In other words, to be able to block this one, I would have to buy the second level, but maybe I want to diversify, so it gives a little asymmetry to people's plans, okay? So, when you purchase one or two, you can block off the one that you must block off the one that you bought, and you may optionally block off another one, okay? Even if you don't take the second one. Uh, correct. Yes. I did not have to purchase that as the second one. If I did purchase the second one, I then, wow, I'm making a mess here, then I could block off a third. You always get one additional more than what you bought if you want to block them off. Does that make sense? Okay, cool. Also, some of these have yearly benefits. Yearly benefits provide players a benefit at the beginning of each subsequent new year. On that player's first turn of the new year, those events trigger, okay, what, or the benefits trigger. And again, you can change turn order there. So those are the eight actions that are on the cross that also can be secondary actions. Any questions on any of those eight? No. No? All right. So moving on, there are two left. Government pipe tiles. Well, this is going to be one of the main areas in which we're going to be able to get more tiles. So, to take this action, place your worker directly on, the, on a remaining pipe tile in an open quadrant of the government pipe display on the board. So you notice it's broken up into four different quadrants. In the first year, any two will be open. Then in the second year, a third one will be open. And in the third year, all four quadrants will be open. However, you might be asking yourself, Self. how does how do you choose? Well, the first player to take the action chooses any tile he wants, or she, sorry. <laughs> you choose one. Let's say it's my turn, I choose that tile. Well, that means this quadrant's gonna be open. I am obligated to buy the tile that I'm actually on, and I can optionally buy any other tile 
that's out there that is sharing a side with that tile that is directly adjacent to it. Meaning one, two, three, four, five. Any of those five tiles can I buy based on that price, ranging from five to $55, depending on how many you buy. Okay, that makes sense? Mm -hmm. Okay, so moving on now, all newly acquired pipe tiles must immediately be placed in a player's personal pipe network, just like these guys did, okay? And the pipes, I should point out, in the government area are never refilled at any point throughout the game. What we have out here, these will refill, these will not, okay? If at some point, let's say I just chose to buy that one tile, on a subsequent turn, somebody comes out, it could be me, it could be somebody else, well, now, if I'm going to purchase tiles there, the only tiles I have available are this one, this one, which I must purchase, this, and this. This is no longer adjacent because there's a gap. Okay? Cool. All right. There's one action left. Running your personal pipe network. This is arguably the most confusing part, but actually not too bad, I think. Okay? To take this action, you're going to place your worker on a pipe tile in your personal pipe network. Let's say I choose this one okay a worker cannot run pipelines that are attached to machines so if i had a machine here i could not run this blue line as an example however you can place it i could still place it there wouldn't be real smart but that's okay i could there we go then you may potentially refine a single barrel of oil for every different pipeline that passes through that tile to a maximum of three well, what three pipelines pass on this tile? This silver one that runs up this way passes through. This blue one, pretty long blue one, passes through. And, oh yeah, this orange one also happens to pass through. So that means I can then refine one gray, one green, and one orange cube of oil or one barrel of oil. So a pipeline is a single unbroken length of pipe in a continuous color, and each pipeline only refines oil of the matching color, obviously. To increase, now this, it's gonna be a lot of words, but bear with me. To increase the quality or the grade of the oil barrel, the player must have a pipeline with a refinement value equal to or greater than the refinement cost for the refinement that they wish to perform, okay? A pipeline's refinement value is equal to the number of connected pipe segments of the same color. So let's, let's break this down a little bit, okay? Pipeline's refinement value. So let's look at this orange pipe that comes through here. Its refinement value is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, because there are seven continuous orange pieces of pipe. So every little segment there is, so there's seven. So now let me draw your attention to the top left part of the board up there. So if you notice the orange, to take a barrel of crude to move it up to low grade is a value of four up there. You see that? And going back to this, I had a value of seven. Well, that tells me I've matched or eclipsed that number. So that means what? I can do this with my orange cube. Boom, I've refined it from crude to low grade, okay? If I also, you know what? Hold on, I'm getting ahead of myself. Now let's look because I can also do the green line as well. The green line has a segment, have a refinement value of one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Well, looking now back out here at the blue, you'll notice that I need five to make it up to low, and then I need another five to make it up to mid, so that's ten. I had a refinement value of 11. Well, that works out. So now I can take one of my green cubes and move it all the way up to the mid level. When doing so, I wanna point one other thing out. Let's say I didn't have any barrels here at low grade. I still could, because that refinement level was high enough to go from crude all the way up to mid level, I could just do like so because that was all done in one action. Don't think of it as a step ladder. Think of it as I just refined it at the mid level. Does that make sense? Is that is that clear? This is probably the most important concept in this game mm -hmm. to understand. Okay, actually that would be back up there. 
And in addition to that, I could also run the silver, which is one, two, three, four, five, six. And what is the value up there? Oh, it happens to be six. Okay, so that means I also, in one action, was extraordinarily efficient that wasn't set up or anything to be able to do all that <laughs> refinement, okay? Good luck at trying to piece that together perfectly mm, yeah, no. on the stream. But that gives you an idea. So is that crystal clear on how refining works? Yes. One point of clarification. Sure. Uh, with the 10 points of, of green, or, right. uh, uh, could you diversify those? Okay, uh, you, okay. so what, what Andrew is asking is with the 10 points of green, again, going back to here, I would need, so you're saying, could I do two barrels of oil to both low grade? The answer is no, because it is one section of pipe, okay? When we get to machines, though, I'll explain how that could change. However, what it could happen, let's say it was already like this, and it's a subsequent turn. At that point, I'm still, if I choose to put my worker here, I now have 10 points worth of green, right? or the, the value of green, well, you notice to go from low to high grade also happens to be 10. Well, in that case, I could either do this to there if I want, or I could go from here to there. If somehow I planned very, very poorly, I could also just forego that and put that there wah, wah, and give you a sad face for doing that. Does that make sense? Yes. Okay, cool. All right, so those are the 10 actions that are available. To recap, two, four, six, eight, placing your worker on a tile to be able to purchase tiles in an open quadrant or running your own personal network. So those are the 10 available actions, okay? So also when you do your personal network, you cannot change order, why? Or turn order, you just drop straight down because it's not one of those four. All right. So when you're done with one of those 10 actions, and maybe a secondary action, we go into the machine phase. Well, let's say earlier, maybe I had purchased a machine over here, and I had placed it over here on my tableau. And I placed the machine here. For $15, I can run any and all machines that are in my network, okay? Well, if I placed it here, I'd pay $15, and now this runs one barrel of oil out of every exit. So in other words, I would run one barrel of oil for a segment of two silver. Two silver, won't won't. that's not doing me any good, so it's wasted. The silver is. Mm -hmm. However, notice the blue now. The blue is now one, two, three, four, five on this exit out this way, and one, two, three, four, five out this way, which, if you look, going from low to mid or, or I'm sorry, from crude to low, low to mid, and mid to high is all five. Well, in that case, if this was here, those are two different exits, so that's two different barrels of oil. That is how you can split them, to kind of circle back to your question so earlier. Conceptually, it's like the oil's literally going through... Different pipes. pipes. It, totally. Through this machine, an exit is a different barrel of oil. Think of it that way. Also, if Maybe I planned really, really poorly and I did something like this. You'll notice that this pipe is connected by two machines. Even though I get to choose the order in which I run these machines, it's as if they run simultaneously, meaning this is one barrel of oil. It doesn't matter which way it goes, it's still one barrel of oil. I could still get two blue, or two green, I'm sorry, through this. One through this, regardless of which machine, and one through this. And then I would also get one silver for that. Does that make sense? Yes. Okay. And again, this is only refining. This is not creating. You must have already acquired oil from what crude or some other level of oil to have made that happen. Crystal clear on that? Mm -hmm. I, I realize I'm beating that home, but I want to stress that. Okay. Because once you understand that, this game becomes pretty simple, mechanically at least. <laughs> All right. All right. We're almost done. So we mentioned contracts and briefly talked about orders earlier. Let's go ahead and drive home on this real quick. At any time on a player's turn during their work or machine phase, a player may fulfill any number of their contracts or available orders. So if I had a contract here, all right? If I had a contract on my turn and maybe I had run, 
I had run this and I just refined all this oil and this is where I ended up. Well, on my turn, I could then put this cube of oil on that. Contracts, you're allowed to partially fill as long as they're completely, hopefully, completely filled by the end of the year. So on my turn, I can partially fill one. What do I get? Well, it depends on the quality of oil that was on the contract. So this one wanted high grade silver. That means I would then get 45 bucks from the bank. If it were mid-grade requested, 35, low grade would be 20, okay? Then on subsequent turns, hopefully I would be able to refine those up to be able to fill those others, okay? Those are contracts. Orders are very, very similar, except those are never acquired by a player. It's just first come, first serve. Those always must be completely fulfilled as well at once. So, hey, maybe I have those three at that level or higher for what it calls for, I can claim that I fulfill it right away. And when I do, I get even more money for it, but it's a one-time use. I turn it upside down and it's essentially out of the game, but we do happen to have an end game scoring tile or a card that has to do with that. Okay. Any questions on that? Notice the orders are three, four, and five uh, barrels of oil respectively for more difficult ones. Okay. Last thing to talk about really is the refresh phase, which happens at the beginning of the second and third years only. So real quick, contracts. We're gonna discard the rightmost column of contracts and then everything is going to slide one to the right and then only one is going to come out in each. So only the leftmost is going to get refilled. And then there's one more set of contracts underneath those. We'll turn those face up so you can see what's coming for the next year. Then after that, the crude and refined markets, we're going to resupply each market as shown on the board. So down here, six more will come up here if there are six spots or less, five, four, and also up in the crude market, we will refill those. Then we're going to remove oil from the three refined markets based on what the board says, okay? So for instance here, remove two from here, it, we would remove the cheapest two if they are filled, okay? Then the tank and machine shops, we fully refill all of these based on player count. Well, in the four player game, everything gets full. We're going to discard all the tiles that are over here and put out based on player count. Again, it's going to be eight every year. Then the upgrades, anything that's been turned face down, we're gonna turn face up again and make those available and begin the next year. At the end of the game, we're going to then go into final scoring. Final scoring, pretty simple. Any oil barrels that are left on your tableau, you're going to sell at that value. Then pipelines in your network, based on what level they can upgrade them to from a starting level of crude oil. So again, this blue one can go 10. I could upgrade from uh, crude up to mid-grade. That would get me 20 bucks for that segment, et cetera, et cetera. Then we're going to score the valuation cards. There's one valuation tile that's in every game. The value of pipelines attached to machines, pretty simple on what that is. Then we're also going to value or score these three, and I think there's 16 of them in the Kickstarter, 12 of them, so there's variance in what comes out every game. Then you're going to lose money for all your penalties, add up any cash on hand, whoever has the most money wins pipeline. Whew. <laughs> so yeah, no sweat, okay? No. <laughs> all right, cool. We ready to play? Yes. Yes. Can I start with this for my pipeline <laughs> is what I want to know now. No. All right. That's a shame. <laughs> so, oh, hold on. Let me fix this. Sorry about that. So while, uh, okay, there we go. Is there any questions that you guys saw from the peanut gallery by any chance? Not all at once. Uh, no, I think everything was taken care of. People answered okay. as cool. they went. All right. Yeah, there's some experts in there. Yep. yep. <laughs> all right. Give me a second. We're going to come on back here. Ah, uh, the joy of live. Hold hmm. on. Do, 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 do. Take your time. I can look at these pipes. Well, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Give everybody a chance. All right. Actually, what we're going to have to do, you guys are going to have to be patient. I'm going to have to fix something real quick. Yay, software. So hold on one second. Sorry, guys. The chat messed up. So, womp womp. Talk, some, talk amongst yourselves. Go ahead. <laughs> I'm just trying to do we plan routes. Maybe you could go over some of the yeah. available. Oh, yeah, we can go over some of these. Uh, so, yeah, these are all your experts down here. 
You talked about the government ones, yes. receiving two government tiles, and then yearly receive one government pipe tile. Yeah. Immediately receive four government pipe tiles if he gets a level two. Uh, level three, immediate receive six government pipe tiles. And that's a maximum of six, meaning yes. if there are there right. be six on if the there board. are six <laughs> available, Correct. Correct. then you will receive six. Uh, then we have human resources over here. You may take secondary actions for free. Wow. Do not pay the usual ten dollar fee. Does sounds really good, right? That's really, really nice. <laughs> but you're paying twenty bucks for that, right? And so you, get, you pay two up front, and then the rest are free. Even if you're getting that secondary action for free, it doesn't mean the action itself is free. So you go to that refined market, you still may have to right. buy right. things. So keep that in mind because money is tight. When taking secondary actions, your worker may move one additional space. The square at the center of the action across counts as a space. So this is, yeah, wow. That's interesting. For level two in human resources, take two worker actions on your turn. You can no longer take a secondary action, so it cancels out that mm -hmm. uh, first level. But the second worker action is available immediately. All really good things. Machines hey, immediately hey, receive one back. machine. Hi, chat. Hey, guys. Hi. All right. Cool. Here, if you would, set those over there, if you would, please, all of them. Cool. All right. Sorry. Yay. XSplit updating in the middle of a stream. All right. Cool. All right. So, hopefully, that was vaguely or crystal clear for everybody. Um, so, just to let everybody know, we are going to, due to space constraints, this is the best that we could do to make everything fit for you guys. My tableau is going to be off screen, and as I add tiles, you guys will be able to see what I'm doing on the tableau cam, but as it is right now, um, mine's going to have to stay off screen. This can actually move up, though, and it still shouldn't uh, interfere with Gorov's area too bad. So there we go. So you guys can at least see me blow my money and how little money I actually end up having. There we go. So place your bets and over under on Glory to Rome's, guys. <laughs> Cheers. All right. Uh, you want a randomized turn order? All right. Oh, no. <laughs> Here we go. You were happy with that? You're, was, yeah. you're like, I'm going to see two turns. One of those. Uh, the worst of worst. Mm. Mm -hmm. mm. I'm okay with that. I don't mind going last. <laughs> Although in the first round, I prefer to go first. Um, oh, hold Why? on. Don't. And before, before we start, well... All right, so welcome, Michael, newest patron. Cheers. All right. All right, good. Thank you. <laughs> Thanks for the support. All right, good. All right, we're good. So, uh, Jess, you're up first, and apparently right. that was a pretty decent teach. Ryan says so, and if the designer says so, then I'm good <laughs> with that. That's, right. that's a good sign. Cool. All right, so it was extremely thorough. It's probably, hopefully, you guys don't need the rule book now when you get the copy unless any rules change. Right. Um, yeah, hopefully uh, folks can use that as a reference. So, Jess, you got one of ten actions. Actually, you I... only have one of nine actions. Because I have You no... have no tableau. <laughs> yeah, right. I can't run so there you go. the pipe that does not exist. All right, cool. All right. All right, all right, all right. I don't mind so You've much. You've had all this time to I've had all this, this time, but I thought you were going to go first, <laughs> and now... Um, I want black. So I'm going to upgrade. Wow, all right. Not what I expected. No. Me neither. <laughs> well, if I do this, I immediately receive two government pipe tiles. Yep. And so that actually goes, that goes right down here. So, so I'm good with that. That's 20. Yep. Which means this is now unavailable. Mm -hmm. and, and I get you to. You don't have to. Oh, I know you don't <laughs> have to. Please don't. But now, <laughs> <laughs> now that I know I can. But there's two I want to block out so badly. The tanks are worth a lot in this game because we're scoring those exactly, twice. Exactly, yeah. <laughs> um, and I may really like that. I didn't really mind people getting that secondary action for free before. Just go chipmunk mode, Abby. So I'm going to block that out. Wow, that's dirty. Yeah. <laughs> All right, now you can change turn order, or do you want to stay first? Um, yeah, hold on. Immediately... Receive two government pipe I know, tiles. I gotta do that first. That was where my first initial thing was. Okay, so pipe tiles that I wanna receive. Now they still have to be adjacent. They do not. Oh, 
What? They do not. It's For that? this, it does not. Really? Yep. Oh, wow. I was just, planning adjacency. Just saying, don't want to make it a six But it has to be in one quadrant? <laughs> That is the one edge case that I knew you were going to ask, yeah. so Ryan. Ryan, does it have to be in the same quadrant? I don't think so, because it says... And I open two in the year. Uh, yep, I think you can dictate which two oh. get opened. Oh, Ryan, so. let me know as I go to pick this and all save right. me from the fact this is going to take me a minute, because we're also waiting for Ryan to say. But not that this is really that helpful, because my brain there's just, isn't yeah, there's that just great too much. Yeah, just grab at two. understanding how this is going to be beneficial to me. <laughs> Matt, who says the game can't be taught in 15 minutes at double speed? At double speed, chipmunk <laughs> right? mode. Get in there. Okay. I know what I want. Oh, and I no, know I want that one. Yes. No. Oh, he answer? said no. Okay. No. It has so to one be. quadrant. I really th but do they have to be adjacent? No, they do not. That I do that. not. Because if, say, only this tile and this tile were the two that were left, how you could choose those. How greedy do I want to be? Okay. I oh, no, it. Ryan says correct. You can pick the two that open. Yes, you can check oh. any, literally any two tiles that are out there, but please do so quickly. All right, all right, all right. Well, you keep changing <laughs> what I'm going to do here. Just pick she, one. she was ready to go. I was, I was. <laughs> and Tim, <laughs> for those that don't know, it, Tim was the lead developer on the game, and I know nice he's at work tonight. So, hi, Tim, Ryan, Clay, gang's all here. Is Ian? I haven't seen him yet, though. Okay. Oh, I was going to do a different thing in a minute. I got you. I'm giving you time. I appreciate it. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, I do want to choose the two quadrants. This is power. I'm just saying. I'm going to do that. All right. Cool. So, All you. yep. Now, while she's messing with that, there you go. Now, she you can she, change turn order as does well. Does she have to choose yeah. whether she's going to take the secondary action? She's probably not I giving you the cash. This is the money right. issue. Um, are you, um, money? I'll be first next time, too. Okay. You so, think you are, so anyways. Right. We'll see. All right. So, all right. So, thinking out loud. Yep. Uh, my guess: the name of the game is selling oil. So, I think going to the crude market seems like a a, a reasonable okay choice. And then my thought process is: it's probably better to. Um, not diversify too much because I'm not going to have enough pipe to upgrade from crude to sure. lower okay. grade. So, All right. And I am unlimited in how much I can purchase? Correct. Well, you're limited to four because that's all you have down on your player board Correct. for how many holding tanks you have. So you're limited by that but and cash, obviously. But other than that, whatever you want to buy. Okay. So I will buy two orange, orange okay. for $10. And I guess I will just stay cheap and okay. go to Gray's for $12. It's efficient, at least, I will say that. Mm -hmm. Just drop them down a little bit. I, there you go, right there. I have the option of taking the secondary action. I will not because Correct. it is too expensive. And turn order, you can change. I can? Yep. Even though I only took the... Oh, sorry. No, no. You. Um, I was looking at white. Sorry. All right. Go ahead. Uh, you just stay second then, for now, anyways. Go up. All right. Three bucks. Three dollars. Thank you. All right. So let's go to upgrades. Let's buy the the human resources one. All right, so you can take secondary actions for free, and so you don't pay the usual 10 bucks. Yeah. So mm -hmm. there, which, that, and you're done? Uh, no, I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Immediately receive one machine, and during the work phase, you can place your worker on a machine that you own to run it at no cost, or you can fulfill contracts twice each year. Um... Contracts are hard, so let's do machines. All right. Well, for what it's worth, I appreciate that. So that was 20 bucks. What else? Uh, so is this immediate? What? That I don't take? Yeah, yeah. It, it, as of uh, right now, so you can take machines and pipes now if you want as well. Well, huh? well I can take the market. refined market. Ah, I keep getting the colors all messed <laughs> up. I'll get, I'll get used to them. I'll take these two. For 10 bucks? Yep. That it? That it. And change in turn order? 
Mm. Hey. No, I think I'm good. All right. Well, I'm buying pipe. I mean, the name of the game is Pipeline. And you'll notice up there that the bottom, the silver pipe, to go from crude to high refined is 14, then 15 for the green, bluish green, and then uh, 16 for the orange. Those were randomly put out there. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. Yep. So orange is going to be require longer runs, obviously. So looking at that and just being the kind-hearted soul that she was, I think I'm going to go ahead and go there, and I'm going to purchase, I think, three, maybe four. Yeah, I'm going to purchase four for 35 bucks, which may or may not be smart. We will see. You can just mm, run the bank. Yeah, we should. Actually... Yeah, that'll work. So thirty-five bucks there, and so that's going to be four bear or four tiles. So if you will help me, that's going to go one, two, three, and I'll take the one up above it as well. This one. Yep. We need there we go. We need the handy wacker. Right. Yeah. Seriously. <laughs> right. All right. Um, then I stay fourth because I can't change turn order. That's the end of the. Nobody has machines, so we we go into the second round. Josh, you're up. While I play Tetris over here. I'm jealous of your four. Um, I'm going to get a contract. You know what? At and least for now, I can do this. This one. There we go. I'm going to defer it. And I am going to take a loan. All right. Really yummy, yummy penalty, penalty cues. Penalties. All right. So 15 bucks. Yeah. And which contract did you take? Deferring it. Okay. Mm -hmm. Cool. And turn and order. Turn order. Uh, good question. Also, refine market three. Let me just look at that. 14. Yes, Efka, I will be taking a loan next turn. Right. Um, no. And I as Ryan said, loans shouldn't be, you shouldn't no. be scared of right. loans. Just be a couple. <laughs> yeah. Okay, yeah. In turn order. Yeah, I'll put myself in for a second. We'll see how that happens. All right, purple. We're just going clockwise. It just so, so happened. So far. Right, right? Yep. Okay, cool. I think I will follow suit a little bit. Doesn't have to be. Now, when I watched uh, Tim and Ryan play a two-player game of this on Tabletop Simulator, they're, obviously they have a couple hundred plays yeah, under their belts. Nice. But watching how, A, how quick the game moves, but also uh, how diverse their strategies can be is... Yeah, I, I'm not saying this is high-level play tonight um, by any of us, but yeah, it's it's pretty impressive. All right, so right. taking a loan. So, so I'm yes, oh. I'm going to take a loan and uh, two contracts. So I'm going to take this All contract. Right. I, it, go big! <laughs> I like it. All right. And this contract, I'm going to defer. So okay. No, keep it face up. Face and up. There you go. And cool. This contract. And take fifteen bucks, and there's your present. Go big or go home. Seriously. <laughs> And turn order. anything refined market, any secondary actions, or just turn order? Uh, I think I'll go first. All right. Go around. All right. Well, everyone's going there, so might as well go there. <laughs> it's where the cool kids yeah. are. Yeah, right? yeah we're just hanging At out. At least until I go there, yeah. All right. We don't have any space for you. Right? <laughs> no. So I will also take a loan. All right. 15. Yes, we got it here. There you go. And find market three is. Yeah, you don't have to do that. Do you want any contracts? I am considering buying one. Um, I will take that one. And 
I'm eyeing two of them. I wish you people wouldn't have taken all these contracts. It's really demoralizing. And uh, do not, you may take secondary actions. Now, do I want to do that for free? Probably not. I won't go for that. Nope. Okay. So. And let's change that up. There. <laughs> so, yes, I'm taking a loan as well. Can I get some fives? There we go. Got it. We're good. We're good. So there's 15 bucks. Contract. So, okay. So, obviously, I'm planning on trying to hook this up and trying to loop it around in a perfect world. I know it seems a bit ambitious. So, basically, we're looking at green and we're looking at orange contracts. Whee! Um, I feel confident. Let me go ahead and get that middle, dead middle contract. And I'm going to defer that puppy to next year, even though it's only, I still got it, what, another six turns? I feel pretty good about it. Turn order wise, I have money. I, I think, um, am I okay with going last? I am not. Let's go ahead and go first. Did you go over the end game valuation cards? I, I, I did, um, briefly. Uh, actually, I didn't go over what specifically they are for our game. So the value of pipelines attached to machines, ten dollars for each tank. So every tank that so everyone's starting with five tanks. By the way, this is the recommended setup. You could have like maybe done something like this if you wanted to at the beginning, but I don't think any of us are at that level to be able to do so. Ten dollars for each tank tile. The value of refined oil in the tanks, meaning we're going to score that twice essentially, and Number of refined oil types in fulfilled contracts and orders, meaning what color and what level. So right here, I only have one right here. So obviously there are other contracts plus orders, don't forget, as well as orders, okay? It's incentivizing you to diversify. It is, mm -hmm. right. Okay. All right, so that's the end of the turn. We go into the next turn. Um, Yep, we're going to go ahead and come over to Tanks and Pipes. There. Gains me access to all of this, so I am going to purchase one tank. And I know I'm going to need three, but I might be able to time it differently. But I'm going to try and get greedy, and I'm going to go buy a tank to put up there. And... So that's going to cost me a total of 20 bucks. So that's 15. Ah, do I? You know what? Let me back that up real quick. On second thought, we're actually going to go. How much are those? Those are seven, seven. up in the crude market there. Yep. Let's go ahead and make it. Let's make it expensive for you guys. Instead, I'm going to spend, we're going to go, nope, just, just one, one and one over there. That's a total of 14 bucks. So let me get a buck back if I could. Probably out of, yeah, I, th I, I feel like this is the right idea because at least one, two, three, four, five, I can at least refine the orange up one level to then be able to flip it, to be able to sell it. And that way I don't have to take a loan if I want. Mm -hmm. And done. Not taking the secondary. All right. Black. So I have 25 bucks. Take three pipes. Let's go there. Oops, oh, there. Pipe better. Yeah, no, no doubt, Tony. All right. And uh, let's take that one. Ooh. Sorry. So where did you place your there. worker? Put him here? Yeah, so this one and this one. And remember, these will never refill. That's these will. 20. Okay? Right. Now we keep moving it. Oh, sorry. I'll it's all right. <laughs> Have it. I, I understand. No worries. You got all this area right up here. All right. Am I going to be building right here as yep, well? Yep, exactly. Let's keep my money on the side. No, you have it. Just keep it up there. There you go. Mm -hmm. You're good. 
All right, so where are we? Um, so, Gorov, you're done, right? Yeah, I'm done. All right, so move him down, and Purple, you're up. Okay, so just a point of clarification. If I were to buy pipe from over here, it's yep. going to cost me... 15 or 40. 15 or 40. Okay. The end. So if I'm looking to buy two pipe, if I can get the ones I want, it's cheaper to buy it from over here. Always. Uh, the government subsidizes it. Think of it that way. Yep. All right, so I think I will... Come over and grab these two for ten dollars. Okay. And I will retain turn order and yep. wait. You're up. Can proceed. I am. Those tiles are going away. The uh, reason we're not playing with poker chips, honestly, the money's it's super thick cardboard. Um, so yeah. I thought this was fine, and it takes up less room. And we already had to zoom out the camera pretty far to see everything, so that was kind of the motivation for that. And Brandon, who pays off loans? Seriously, right? <laughs> oh, wait, I did today. Sold the house. <laughs> so I guess did. paid so off two loans. Well yeah. Well done. So. Uh, three for 20, and I'll just take those. I am no longer hugely in debt <laughs> to the bank. Huge. All right. All right, and that's it, and okay. you're done with turn order. So next round. So you can see how turns should, in theory, move quicker mm -hmm. now at this point. So my turn is going to be really unexciting. Mine's going to go, I'm going to activate these tiles, so I'm going to run my personal network so I can run a green of two. Well, green of two doesn't do me any good, but one, two, three, four, five. That gets that puppy to there, boom, done. Yellow's done. Black, you're up. All right. I am going to come over here and buy this last tile from the squadron for five bucks. Really? You've been figuring that out, Efka? That's impressive. And, and nobody read that. Don't worry about it. Is there really? Yeah, there is only one. You're right. I'm not going to say which one it is, though. And I'm going to let them burn brain power trying to figure it out. Andrew, you're up. <laughs> <laughs> I have no idea what you're talking about. Don't worry about it. Care to explain it? No. <laughs> I, will, I will when it becomes my turn again. In two t rounds. Because <laughs> I can't do it until then. I'm betting on the come, okay, FK? So I will. Me and my foo foo, twelve year old high school girl or twelve year old girl, uh, frappuccino. I figure it was gonna. <laughs> did you be, put the pinky out? I did. Okay. I, I figure it was gonna be warm in here, so yeah. Cools you down. So I'm gonna go here. Tank some pipes. So. And buy some pipes. Okay. So I'll buy two pipes for fifteen dollars. Okay. And I'm just gonna stick with orange and silver. This one. Uh, can I buy from oh, it has any to be of these from, eight okay. right here? So I will buy. Just make sure. Uh, all right. So yeah, I think I'll and we'll figure it out. Okay. Okay, fifteen bucks. And are you changing turn order, sir? I will. Go last this time. All right. And mm -hmm. Jess. Mm -hmm. So many things I want to do. <laughs> sure. <Whew. laughs> well, there I am. Oh, seriously, I think it's there three rounds till I can do it. <laughs> Uh, well I was busy it. trying to figure out what yeah, it was, I, I know. And, that, and now I don't know what to do, but I'll grab a thing. I mark a two, 12. This game accelerates. I mean, the whole point is to get your engine going in the first handful of rounds. Right. Get, get something started and then start making money so that right. you can extend and make more money, right? right. Probably that. 
Okay, so I'm just going to go here. Okay. No, I'm just brat. You're such a brat. I know you are. All right. 12 bucks? Yeah. Yeah, the game plays surprisingly quick, and it doesn't go on as long as you think it will. Um, so uh, she will slide into third, unless she's paying the ten bucks, mm -hmm. which I'm I not. Yeah, right. Okay. All right. Next round. So for me, it's not worth it. Ugh. Really? Yeah, I guess so. Well, if I. There, 10, can't do that, can't do that, can't do that. Mm. All right, <laughs> so I am going to lament my choices in life, and I'm going to go to refined market number two, and I'm going to sell this low-grade orange for 30 bucks. Mm -hmm. Woo! Money. Rolling deep now. <laughs> All right. So, we have... Sold. So we're good. The first right. sale. Yep. You will be first place. First yep, turn. Yep. Yep. All right. Go around. Uh, no. So, yeah. Go around. Black. Uh, all right. Hey, Shingo. What's up? I will run this. Um, green line for yep. one, two, three, four, five, six. Yep. Which is more than the five I need. So right. Go up one. And to be clear, since you were only running that one green line, you could have placed it on and literally yeah, any yeah, tile yeah. to do so, right? Correct. Okay. All right, cool, done. And that's it. That's yep. it. Wait. God damn it. <laughs> I didn't say anything. What? Mm. No money. You could always run the silver. I can run the silver. I just wonder if just we, have big plans. If we were to play a game of jigsaw puzzle with all these tiles, would it like would everything connect to everything? Would it? Five, would it Clay and and, and uh, Ryan? One. I'm curious. Would it? Would they all connect? Would have you guys figured that out? Sure. 135 individual pictures of pipe tiles. Yeah. yeah I just imagine they had one big. Picture and they just so how 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 long it's of a six, run? It's six, and okay. so it only it moves that up. Yeah. Okay, cool. All right, that's done. Purple. All right, I'm going to go purchase this. For Not for this Shingo. Dollars. Honestly, we needed we needed the real the screen real estate for this because um, for the top to bottom to be not zoom out even further, uh, we sacrifice. So we have Jess, me. We have Andrew up there and Gorov. There we go. So sorry about that, guys. All right, is that it? Yes. All right, new round. Yes! All right. <laughs> so we're going to tanks and pipes. Mm-hmm. And... Please don't take it. Where, oh, this one. Right here, for sure. Because that bad boy is... <sighs> Okay, there's one. I'm definitely going to buy one other. So that's going to be 15 for that. And I am going to buy one more tank as well. Which is going to go there. And the second one... Is going to be... This one. Mm. Right there. You guys can still see all that. Nice. Yeah. All right, cool. We'll condense these down. And turn order. Let's see. I will... Uh... I will go last. Oh, that's what that was. Hey, my network adapter. All right, cool. All right. So... Over to let's go over to refined market two and sell this deal over there for twenty five. What did I do it right, man? You got 
It's funny how the peanut gallery can judge. Like they're like, oh, it's so clear. I'm like, sit here and try it. It's, it's, oh, uh, all right. And yeah, um, did I, I shoot badly? <laughs> there were other options, but it took me that whole time, like three turns, to figure it out. Really? And I will not pay the ten bucks. Instead, I'll take this. Um, oh, Andrew, scoot the your pipeline towards your board yeah, a little. Just a little. There you go. Don't judge me. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't run infinitely, though. All right. Okay. So All right. There you go. Do what now? They're, guess, they're pushing it. See this. But the one question about the loop, you, you clearly can create a loop. But. The top left is in the bottom shot. That one? Why? Play Jigsaw. Wait a second. <laughs> Tetris. I just adjusted mine. I think this was like Why, why did I have taken that? Or, oh, yeah. snap. <laughs> well, shoot. All right. Mistakes were made. Oh, well. All right. Because you clearly had the time between all of that. Yeah, my bad. <laughs> my bad. All right. I have failed you guys. I'm it sorry. took me 15 minutes to figure it out. All right, so go, Rob. You're I'm, done? I'm done. Uh, oh, my turn. Hold on. Uh, Let's go first. Oh, you're going to go first. Hold on, wait. Oh, you paid to do the secondary? I, I, I did not. Uh, oh, well, paid, <laughs> but yeah. Well, right. my HR right. paid for it. <laughs> it's good all to right, have cool. human resources. Nice. Uh, I'm going to sell things. Money. Mm. There you go. Mm, really? Well, hey, it's, it's the exact same. Well, it's yeah, it's the exact same bucks. thing I did. It's cash. It is. If cash. you rub them together, they have babies or, Yay! Some yeah. or something like that. Oh, multiply. Right. Exactly. So Jess is done. Well, are you taking a secondary? I am not. All right. So no. So yep. we'll fall the so third. Correct. Okay. And quick clarification. Yep. If, if I'm running to uh, different. Uh, oil yep. through different, two different pipes. Uh, do I choose the order in which they upgrade? In other words, can I clear a spot from one level? Oh, that's to... a fair point. But yes, you could. Okay. Yeah, you you decide. I yes. figured, but um... oh, I appreciate that, Matt. Night bulb. All right, so <laughs> I will, and you can make sure I'm doing this correctly. All right. So, so if I go here, I, I can run. I to do something. Can I go back in? Sure. Well, no, it's all right. Sorry, asterisk. You're fine. No. <laughs> <laughs> what I did you print here? Oh, this. All right. Okay. Nobody so, went there. That's why. All right. Two bucks back. Yes. I, I, all right. Thank you. All right. So, so go ahead. this would be four orange, which is enough to upgrade this from yep. crude to low. And then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, which is enough to do that. Yes. Correct. Yeah. Nailed it. There okay. you go. Well done. And you're taking second. Next round. Oh, I'm first. There you go. All cool. Right. All right. So. There's <sighs> one missing, but that's okay. So are you, while, while Gorav is lamenting his choices in well, life, is it, make, <laughs> is it making sense to you guys? Are you guys able to follow along? And obviously you guys are able to critique my, my life choices over here in pipes. <laughs> I see it now. <laughs> my bad. My bad. Sometimes you get so laser focused on um, what you want to do, yeah. and yeah. All right, I'm okay. Andrew. Okay, can I duplicate the same? Action? You you can leave him there and say I'm running it again. Okay, so this is why I was asking earlier. I'm going to upgrade the gray because yep. it's this. Right. Yes, actually. So it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Unfortunately, not eight. Which it, that is not eight. Plan correct. better, and then. Run right into orange again. Orange there you go. that. And now I believe I can mm -hmm. fulfill my contract. Yep, you absolutely can. Which so I, I want to do. There you go. And you did two low grade. That's going to be 40 bucks there. And if you would also bring your money to the top of your player aid or a player board, just okay. so folks can. There you go. So you get 40 bucks total, 20 for placing each cube onto the contract. And those will stay there until cleanup now. To show that, okay, hey, you do not get an orange cube or a red cube, penalty cube. Well done. He's a quick study. Hashtag good teacher. All right, <laughs> Josh, you're up. All right, I know where I want to go. Let's see if I can figure out what I want. Okay. 
Hanks. I'm gonna get two of. So that's ten. Yeah, I know, Efka. I'm sorry. Hope you're feeling better, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> no, you've been under the weather, so that was me last year. I mentioned on Twitter I was sick for six six weeks after Gen Con. What were they saying you should do? You should buy this one. Is that what they were saying? Yeah, uh, yeah because had I bought this one, that it would have went there. done uh, both of those instead of coming down south. So yeah, yeah well, hey, replayability. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, do better next time. Right, bite better. Mm-hmm. So I can't That's amazing 15. that both of those are so gone, I'm gonna get two. right? So what? I'm going to get two pipes. I'm In the machine? Well, are you? Well, Where are you? Tanks. Oh, so these two? <laughs> yeah, because that's oh. it. I will figure that out. Yes. And you she will had, like it. She yes. had a choice. Yes. One. One. And turn One order? One choice. Oh, yeah. Jess? Jess. Um, hmm. Hmm. We are coming up to the end of the year. Keep I know. That, in mind. that is true. Yeah, I'll go. It doesn't really matter to me. No, I'll stay third. I'm fine there. Oh, that's glorious. Wow, I get to stay fourth for free. That's wonderful. <laughs> oh, right. I can go fourth. Yes, actually, thanks for that. <laughs> I was thinking I didn't want to move up. <laughs> Say I things. The decision things happen. Made. No, I, all right, nobody my bad. went yet. Well, all right. So, what do I want to do? Obviously, I'm not going out there. I'm not doing this, but I could go up for machines and pipes, because you don't have to purchase machines, you can purchase pipes if you want, but I do need, I desperately need... Money. Okay. Well, yeah, you don't have to buy machines, as you said. Right. Okay. Uh, yeah, and now I'm lamenting my life choice on that. That's so ah. bad. So that would be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I would be in good shape. But do I roll the proverbial dice and try and get something better than that to be able to extend for orange? I'm 15 bucks, then I'm broke, then I'm going to end up having to take a second loan. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four. Four, 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 four. Mm. Wow, yeah, that was such a bad mistake I made. because then I gotta buy I don't have to buy the oil I would be able to one two three four five six seven eight nine ten that would actually get me to the second level which that would get me 45 bucks but then I would have to refine that three turns next turn you know what oh, but I don't want to have to take a second loan I won't, because I have the aura. All right, I will do that. So we're going to machines and pipes there. Plus, it allows me to manipulate turn order. So it might be a little short-sighted. So there's one for sure that I'm getting. And I will figure out the second one here momentarily. And go ahead and mark me down as last, please. And that's the end of the turn. And I'll pay my 15 bucks. And go, Rob, you're up. And Four. this is the last hey Vince. turn of the year. Of the year, correct. So it does, nobody has any unfulfilled contracts, so you're okay. Um, but just be aware we're going to have a refresh phase to where more contracts are coming out. These are all going to wipe and refill. Uh, more tanks will come out, and some of these will replenish. Same with the other crude market, okay? And I'm still deciding on a second one in the meantime. So, go Rob, you're up. Yep. Deciding what to do with these two cubes. All right, so let's... I keep wanting to look at yours. <laughs> uh, 
<laughs> yeah, right? <laughs> Choices. I know, right? That one's not bad for me. One, two, three, four, five. Right, so that's. I almost don't even really want to mess with that. Okay, so let's run this one more time. So I have. Goes there and there. Yep, because it's running both silver and green. Yep. And Andrew, you're up. Okay. Yeah, I am. I think. It's relevant as to what I may do, so. Yep, taking that one. Done. Okay. Alrighty. Um, Should I tell him it was a wrong tile again? <laughs> <laughs> Do what? Should I tell him it was the wrong tile again? Was it? I, I, oh. <laughs> oh, wait, what? Is no, somebody? Oh, no okay. Point. Oh, yeah, <laughs> my bad. No, let it slide out uh, <laughs> Right. Doing the best I can, all right? All right, so where are we at? Uh, it's me. So the price for the first machine is $20? It is, yes. correct. Any and the, the second machine. Any of the top row. Yep. No. Yeah, if any of y'all in the peanut gallery ever want to come and try and sit in this chair, you are more than welcome. <laughs> All right, so I think I'm going to go here. All right. But not buy a machine yet. Okay. I'm going to... It's all good. And what, we are broke. Almost. And I am no well, what no. Almost. At least at least you can rub them together <laughs> to make me have babies. I can't even I can't rub one uh together. Uh, let's see uh, if they make another buck. Right, seriously. <laughs> uh, fifty cent quarter. <laughs> all right, maybe so, they'll have twins. Little money. Maybe they'll have twins. Quadruplet. Oh, very nice. Um, oh. Not overthinking it. Yeah, <laughs> Just that looks awfully no, good. Hurts. It hurts. That looks fantastic. Mm. All right, uh, changing turn order at all? Oh, I didn't decide. Uh, yeah, these. I will take first. There's so much to do. Sure, you will. Temporarily. Yeah. I, <laughs> all right, and Josh, Until you're it up. comes to yeah. a yeah. yellow player. I'm starting yeah. to realize the advantage of going last. This. Oh no, Ryan! I did not. No, 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 no. God. No, that's fine. Why do you call that? Oh, no, no. I'm not saying just come and sit in one of the other seats. I'm saying come and run the stream. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Teach it. Keep everything going. Make sure everyone's involved. Handle mm. chat and try and play the game. Do all of that. My bad. The cameras <laughs> move them around. It's insane. Uh, I do. Hold on. How did that go? <laughs> <laughs> like she was getting ready to pounce. I would like That's to awesome. pound. How long did the setup take? Really good to do. Ah, oh, I have a blinking box. Man, I need so many. Setup things. actually isn't as bad as you would think. Uh, the first time it was, the the rules do a very good job of taking you step mm -hmm. by step through the setup. But it's actually once you get it bagged up, like you know, you get the machines together, you get these together. Right, the the uh, the towers o tiles for the pipes off to the side and everything. The hardest thing is the three, four, and five, and the low, mid, and high, separating those out, and that's not even hard. Um, there's also seven value refinement costs up there, but it recommends not playing with those until you're more experienced. So it's really not that bad. Yeah. And hey, Rob, hush. All hey, right, Brian. that's me. And, and I, do? no, just ran. So first time. And All right, up so I'm up, huh? Mm-hmm. Well. So I misjudged something, FYI. Um, yeah, I, I wanted to be able to run my network here, but then I can't change turn order. AKA plan better. Yeah, you know, very much so. Um, going for, uh, you know what? It might be short-sighted, but I'm going to. So I'll take a loan. Just to I am not afraid of the loan just to manipulate turn order yep 
Oh. Oh no. <laughs> it doesn't work that way. Never mind. Let's back that well, up. Here, I'll, I'll go ahead and say what I was going to do. So I was going to get enough money to then be the first to be able to get yeah. the upgrades, but last I checked, 16 bucks ain't 20 No. And you can take how many loans? One. Yeah, my bad. Mm. All right, fine. That is so horribly inefficient. Mm -hmm. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten is bloop, all yeah. the way up. Boom, done. I'm staying fourth. We go into the new year, and here we go. So to make sure that we do this right for the refresh. So you'll notice the refresh there. So the contracts, the far right edge comes off. Everything slides one over and only one, the left level, there you go, comes through. We flip the others face up to show what's coming out for the last year. Then we're going to refill the tanks. We're get, These will go away. And we'll put out 16 new ones out there. Then we're going to refill, so four or two in this case. Five. Okay, so we're refilling all of those, and we're refilling everything up north as well. And if you can, in the crude market. I would just say, as far as setup, uh, you really benefit from the E&O tool. Oh, the graphic design, <laughs> graphic design yeah, is fantastic. Like the, it's the marking on yeah, everything. It's, it's very thing. easy to see where yeah. things go. Yeah. It really, Absolutely. really is. Also, one other thing that I noticed the last time that we played this is the co uh, how much you get from the contracts and the orders is also yep. up here to show that orders are more lucrative as well. Um, also, you'll notice that one comes off here, one comes off here, and three would come off here, but as it were, there. Uh, and I think I get to open the government market because I have that. Uh, not yet. Wonder it's on your first on your first on action. Your first action. You get okay. to for your yearly action. Those should look and back. these exactly. These are oh, open yeah. for business once again. And mm -hmm. our deferred become active now. Yes, and deferred contracts move over to active. Nobody. Uh, those also will clear off. There you go. There we go. And now you must fulfill it once again, and that one as well. Yes. Cool. We're ready uh, to go. Purple, you're up. Cool. Right. Oh, I didn't take the second loan. Thank you, Eric. I appreciate it. Me and my you could keep buff. the queue. <laughs> I could, but no. All right, so I will take the benefit of going first at the start of a new year. Okay, upgrade. so upgrade. The other benefit is to choose, remember, if you want right. to well, build But pipes. if I choose the blue one, then I also have the choice of just... Fair point. There is that. Uh... Immediately receive two tanks. And yep, and one, one shop pipe from either shop, meaning these eight here, and yearly receive two tanks. And remember. Yeah, that's what I... <laughs> uh, right, immediately so, receive one machine. So uh, we covered, yeah. I'm going to pay the $20 just so I don't forget. And but <sighs> Thanks, Rob, and thanks, Eric. We're good. I think I will take the engine, the government. This one? Yes. Okay. Immediately receive two government tiles. And do you wish to block off any other? I don't have the money, so yeah, I'm all for it. Uh, I, will, I will block off the, the other one that I think is good. There we go. Done. And I'll right. decide which market to open. Yep. Stick with my theme. Oh, I'm check this one. Ooh, okay. What happened? Yeah, I know. Um, talk to uh, talk to Waymost. He was supposed to be working on it. Thanks, Rob. Will you open that one? Yep. Okay. Yes. We'll give it away. The big gaping <laughs> hole. In the yeah. Oh. <laughs> I was like, did I miss one? That's painful. That's not the one you wanted. Nope. And it does not have what I need at all. There's a board for that, you know. <laughs> There is a board for that, Jess. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's <laughs> one glory to Rome. <laughs> I gotta find the stickers to update this number. 
It's, uh, let's see, what is that? It's... I know what box that's in. Oh, Go awesome. On. We're like 30 behind on this, so we're keeping track of them, though, guys. She looks so pretty sitting up there. Yeah. Uh, oh, Rita? Rita. <laughs> oh, dude. She ha doesn't need a man. <laughs> And apparently it's never going to be me, according to the promo. Nope. So, all right. So you're done. Uh, changing turn order. Black, you're up. Oh, this hurts. Damn it. Wait, I, I also have... All right, I don't have enough money. So proceed. All right. Go, Rob. You're up. Mm -hmm. oh. Why do you hate me? <laughs> I also realize there's interesting decisions as far as blocking other people. Which, which sure. Specific. Yeah, because right now you at max can buy three. Mm -hmm. Let's sell these two. All right. That could not have oh, been. Oh, this one. was sec mid grade. Yeah, forty. Do you even know what to do with eighty-five bucks? I. I've there. never seen so much money in my life. Uh, <laughs> Not in this, there's no least. 50 on my side. I you clearly right, set yeah. it up better. No, yeah. right, we should have planned better. Uh, all right. Now oh, we can. No. And do I? <laughs> do I want a loan? <laughs> <laughs> I do not. Okay. I'm all so set. you're done. I'm all set. And so no change in turn order. Jess, you're up. Yep. All right. Have a good one, Efka. Keep feeling better. We'll see you around. Thanks for hanging out, dude. Oh, this hurts. Mm, all right. So I get to take a tile, but I have to take it from the open market. Yep. Let me exit. If you missed that. Nothing is the way I need it <laughs> at all. I hate this. Wow, that's not terrible. Oh, yeah. it, it is. It's wor it was, there were better <laughs> options over there. Uh, Just saying. It's fine. Um, always have a plan B. All right. And just to be clear. Yeah. No, that's mean. Never mind. Yeah, they, oh, there you go. Is, is plan B short for plan better? Yes, it <laughs> yes, is. It totally it is. is yeah. It absolutely is. Yeah. Oh, I need money. <laughs> Damn it. You, ha you could always sell. I mean, you're going to need it, but there's only five rounds left. I could always, yeah, sell this. Yes, but that's still not enough money. That is what's going to hey, happen. Hey, Joel. That'll be 30. Sure. So if I mark it one. Do I want any? I can't even pay the 10. So. Nope. If I mark it one, so you're selling it? Yep. 30 quiche. Mm-hmm. And I'm going to assume you're not going to spend the 30 bucks to take an upgrade. But could be wrong. I don't want to assume. Because it costs 10 to do the secondary and mm -hmm. then 20 for the upgrade. There are nope. two things about no. this game, at least at the level where I'm at right now, that I feel like we're just here to mock me. One, the 500 yeah. Value <laughs> yeah. Uh, uh, money. Yeah. I think that's really funny. It's a, it's a and lot of uh, you may fulfill contracts twice yeah. each, each year. year. <laughs> really? Sure. Like, sure. <laughs> like fulfilling them once is so easy. Yeah. Right, yeah, right. Yeah, it's simple. Uh, ask ask uh, me and Jess and actually Andrew too. We'll find uh, out. <laughs> uh, at the end of this if, if that's it. So here's the thing yeah. that I forgot. So it's now my, uh, oh, wait. So much trouble. Yeah, she's, there you go. So I'm up. The thing I was forgetting is I don't have to actually take the refined market action to get rid of this because this can come there. straight over there, which is even better. It gets me 10 bucks less money, but it's a third of what I need, nice. and it doesn't take an action. So there's 35 bucks. Oh, glorious. Look at that. My solo buck yeah, right. had a baby. We wiped the bank. Seriously. Oh, that's glorious. There we go. So now... Well, what do we need? We need oil. I need some oil. And purchasing it while it's cheap kind of makes sense. So let's go ahead and hook that up. So we're going to go refined market number one. I will go ahead. Hmm. Four. Nope. I'm going to. I'm going to just, do I just get two? Let me look. So there's 10 bucks for sure. I could go 10 bucks and then I'm still $4 short, 
for the upgrade. And that's seven if I do that. Nope, that's it. I'm done. So drop it. Next round. Still in fourth. Yep. All right. And Andrew, you're up. Okay. Well, I am short on cash. So I am going to actually... Yeah, Chris, she did take it from down here. Lamented her choices. <laughs> oh, it's terrible. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to go to Refined Market 3 and sell this mid-grade. Uh, uh, yep, mid-grade. Yep. For 45 I believe. Uh, that would be 45 correct. And that's the other nice thing about the contracts is these kind of clear, whereas some of these will clear, but the top end, you'll notice up here, does not. So, well done. And then... I can purchase as well, mm -hmm. so I'm going to... And remember, you could if you wanted. I'm not saying you want to, but just a green. reminder, you can also purchase this oil, and obviously the one you just bought or sold doesn't make sense. You do all your selling first, then you buy. Okay, and I will buy two oranges. For 14 And I get a dollar back, and I am done. And that's it. Yep, go around. Bust. I will choose first. Let's <laughs> go there. Buy stuff. Twelve, fourteen, twenty-six. That must feel good. Yeah. To be able to pay for something, yeah. Right. <laughs> and that it? Nope. Or a secondary, <laughs> that's right. Mister, I get my free ones. Yes, I do. Uh, I need some change, but I'll take them. Later. I would say I'm not bitter, but I totally am. And I shall take machines and pipes, but... Which pipes to take? This feels like it's moving quickly. It, oh, it, it very much ramps up. I mean, once you get your engine going, then it's just boop, 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 boop. Game's over. Mm -hmm. So, and obviously the stream adds one, time to the... Uh, that one. To each of the actual game length. Because uh, two-player is no more than an hour, which shockingly quick for as big a game as this is. I'm done. Done? And... And Jess, you're up? Yeah. All right, so 16, 18, that's all my money. What do you think? Do um, so I'm looking at the crude market because I could get two types of oil up there. That's pretty much all my money, and I can't really efficiently run them right now because my pipe system is lacking. So trying to focus on this contract. We don't have a lot of rounds left. Um. And if you notice, there's not a lot of adjacency down here. Well, hold on. Um, what? If you were to work on that tile right there. Yeah. Oh, hold on. Scoot it down a little. I'm so aware. Far. Like, okay. I, I, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So I can get to that grade. I need to get higher than that. But it also gets you the silver, too. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Right. I understand. Even if I went here, I can run them all even in orange. That's not what I'm worried about. So that brings me on that one just to this level. Neither of those really, really help me because I have to keep running. Do it, it twice. And keep running. Yeah. Do it twice. Right? Sure. Well, but I'm not I saying it it's three. efficient. I'm just saying you <laughs> I need could. it three times. So well, that's really inefficient. But and you have five rounds. So that's I okay. also don't have any oil here. So there's so there's that running months. that exactly, <laughs> um, and then the money to be able to do that, and so yeah, it's all <laughs> not good planning on my part because I was all like, that'll be there when I no, nope, <laughs> nothing happened in that regard. So I'm gonna, uh, it's probably the wrong move, but I'm gonna go there and spend for three and see if that equates to anything. Godspeed. Yeah. Okay. One, two, three. Mm. Oh, mistakes were made. I see this now. Um, 
horribly inefficient. So I could I could get a machine, but I just don't think it's worth it. Going over to the tanks and pipes for fifteen bucks. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hmm. I don't think I need to. I think I'm just going to... Uh, I hate the idea of going and just buying two cubes for an entire action. But getting machines and pipes, this is the one that I want. So I need to be able to go to <laughs> tanks and pipes to be able to do that. And going to refine market two doesn't help me because that gets me silver. It doesn't get me orange. <laughs> um, so, you know what? We're going to stay in target <laughs> here. There we go. I'm just going to go there and just run that to there, which then immediately brings that over to there, which is 35 bucks. And you run that to this goes yep. down. Thank you. <laughs> All right, black is me. It is <laughs> right. Which... All right. That'll work. Go to tanks and pipes. All right. Buy two tanks for ten. And two pipes for fifteen. Uh, and while I select, I'll first. All right, purple, you're up. All right, I am going to place this here, and I can run. This pipe has capacity four, one, two, three, four, and this other orange pipe has a capacity of six, so I can move both of these up one level. Yeah, yep. And then immediately I will fulfill my contract. And that's another 40 bucks. $40. Well done. And that is my turn. And Jess, when you're done Tetrising. We when? did say I had until. <laughs> All right, I'm going to... Thank you. Hold on. Here, since you guys now understand how where the valuation and all that is, I'm actually going to move the chat over here. And just know that there, those are you. covered up for the year so that you can see Jess's pipeline. Okay, now that she's... it's getting snaked. It is. It all finally right. reaches so 15, up. so that happened. That was good. That was hard. <laughs> breaks my brain. Um, so I should get some green. Probably. I have just enough money to do that up there. Or, yeah, okay, I can come down here. Choose a market, any market. I'm going to choose a market. I have 18. I can get two up there, or I can get... Oh, same here. Punch board paradise. 3D aspect of clinic broke my brain. So you're getting four of them? Uh, no, I cannot afford to do such things. I only have $18. Oh, I apologize. I'm getting two. All right. Sorry. I would love to get four of them. <laughs> All right. My bad. My bad. I remember you, you were Diamond Jim Brady over here not too long ago, so... And she's staying there because she went to Refine Market 1. Yep. Yep. Not yes, paying the 10 bucks for any upgrades. So I got all this money burning a hole in my pocket. Um, I mean, I could do that again, but I feel like, okay, I can do that on my last turn if need be to be able to get that refined. So I feel like I should be improving my position in life. <laughs> I'm glad I could help, Tony. Hurts so good. All right, so we're going over to tanks and pipes. And I know for a fact that I'm going to buy one tank. Going to go there. And the question is whether or not I'm going to buy four or whether I'm only buying two of these bad boys. So let me... If you'll give me just a moment. So I know I'm doing that. 
So there's one. I've pretty much punted on silver, haven't I, looking at this oh, here. So and I have two individual ones there. Somehow I still hear Efka in my head yelling at me right now. Mm -hmm. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Pretty sure that's not fifteen. Um, that's still twelve. Thirteen. I can only get to four, fourteen, can't I? Oh, hold on. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. I don't need to do that, though. I think I'm going to go there and... So that's two tiles. I think I'm going to... That's 16. Ouch. One, two, three, four, five. Um, I'm going to stop there for 15. Just by those two. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. That leaves me three. Plus that, yeah, I'm done. That's it. And change it done order. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I'm gonna go first. All right, so I'm back up now. And how much? The it's nine up there. So I'm going to the crude market and going to buy I'm buying those two green and one orange. So is that 23 bucks, I think? Uh, yep. Yes. Yeah. All right, I need 7 back. I need one single from over there, please. Got it. I got I give it to them. Yep, we're good. There we go. Thank you. And <laughs> are you paying me. ten to do an extra? Uh, for machines and pipes, I am not done. All right. Okay. So I'm going to oh. go. Have a good night, oh, Espen. Thank you. Thanks for hanging. Excited. You're excited. <laughs> Just don't want it to get blocked. I agree with that, Joe. Yeah, a Meeple Realty insert for this would be ideal. Yeah. It's not bad as is, but they do make set up and tear down easier. There is no doubt about that. So you're going. Yeah, I'm thinking. I think you guys talked about this, but Tony's like, that's it. The line, it breaks my brain, is good enough to put me into full Yeah, I, did. I was mode. like, I'm glad I could help. Yeah. <laughs> I also just figured out three things I could have done differently. So there's that. <laughs> Just three? Just <laughs> <laughs> Gives you reason to play it again, it right? It does, it does. Can I buy something that helps me? No. Think out loud, it, it just, just shows much better. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> there's nothing I don't know, I think they like well, the pain. Yeah, there's nothing out, <laughs> there's literally nothing out here that I need. Yeah. So One thing that I feel out. like everybody has been overlooking, everyone's been focused on the contracts, don't forget about the orders. Yeah. yeah How remember do you know the that? Because we could be in our you head could be, You could this. be, I'm just saying. Because you just fulfill been... those on your turn, so. Right. I mean, that's comical, though. I'm just, I'm just saying that that's just. That's silliness. <laughs> just silly. I, I have a question. Uh, yeah. Can you fulfill orders during the machine phase? Yes. You can, but it's all at once. Okay. No. Okay. <sighs> <laughs> How'd that go? Who, who needs orange anyway? Right, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> exactly. Orange and, is great. And, uh, all right. So, let's... so orange and silver. 
run this. Green. <laughs> <laughs> I tried. I started out diversifying. Blue, and then green and a little bit of out. orange and green and silver. All right. Hence. Pain. Yep. Yep. So yep. That's also the problem. Yep. Everybody going after them. Nice. Same. Done. Thing. Yep. And no turn order. All right. Purple. Oh, it's just All right. Um, I'm buying some tanks. So I'm gonna go here. And is there any limit as to how many tanks nope. you can buy? Nope. Well, how many you can buy? Cash three, limited? Cash yeah, limited. that too. Yes. Yep. So I'll buy five. It's 25 bucks. Yeah, I feel you. <laughs> <laughs> is that it? Any pipes? Uh, I'm taking the... Um, I can buy two for 15. Four for 40. <laughs> not buying four for 40. Sound like a Why barker. Not? Right? Yeah, exactly. Two for 15, two four, four for 40. 40. Right? <laughs> ah, it's even more Shoot. money. Yeah, you know you want more of them. <laughs> you, you know it. Come on. Take them while Thanks they're hot. And Tim says you can't sell to the order in the middle of an action, so you have to run the machine all the way to sell the order. So, all right, good to know. Yeah, ask that question and come up, yeah. Hmm. Uh, ba, 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 ba. Is that where that goes? Okay. Just trying to separate yeah. a little bit oh, so folks know. Yeah. There you go. Because we need some yep. room when this comes out. Yeah, yeah I will sure. I will buy two for fifteen. All right. So which two would you like? Sir? Are you sure? Oh I'm down there. You yeah. are. Okay. Tanks and yep. pipes versus yes, yes, machines yes, yes. and pipes. Yep. Uh, I'm distracted by all the orange. How many <laughs> players have more money than they started with? We don't need to talk about that. Why are we right discussing now, these Ryan? things? Don't, don't worry yeah, about it. I mean, okay, don't, don't it's early. It takes money it's, to make money. It shaming, does. Shaming on live TV. I know. Right? <laughs> what kind of monster? Be kind, are you, Ryan. <laughs> Jeez. Uh. Right, right, because you can't see it, and then yeah, I know it's. What you missed is like when I was. Dying All right, Martin. Over here. Thanks for hanging out. We'll see you Thursday for Barrage. Hi, Martin. He was trying to. He was like, "Here, you need this tile. <laughs> I have what you need." All right, so I'm gonna. Yep, that's gonna cool. That, no, that works. That's perfect. That there you go. <laughs> <laughs> and, then, and actually, now that we move chat, you can actually move yours. Yeah, you up have some room. You bit. can go up a little. Can I move it up? So you can, yep. you into can. mine. Well, it's you fine. Think we'll share. It's, it's okay. Yeah. Right. Whoa, whoa, whoa. This, <laughs> this is not a. Semi-co-op? Right. Maybe we yeah, can yeah. talk. <laughs> yeah, yeah, all right, all right, go ahead. And then I'm going to take the secondary action for $10. Okay. All right, because you purple. have money. So going over to Refine Market. And I'm going to buy, I have $29. So I will buy as much as that gets me. There you go. I so don't 14, 22, that's, I think I can Wait, make that, three. Hold on, 16 and uh, 12. 12, that's 28 bucks, 28 right? bucks, so I have a dollar. Yep. And you can change turn order if you want. I will go last. Okay. And Jess? Oh, I do not have enough moves left. So. <laughs> do you guys even pipeline, bro? Exactly. No, yeah. no, this right. is yeah. really, really bad. For real, right? We are not plumbers. Um, <laughs> we are not. No. I think that was a... Uh, although if if uh, if my buddy Lyndon were watching, he is like you even a rough neck, bro. I mean seriously. Nope. That is all I'm doing, and I would like to let you know that I all, I volunteered as tribute to go to come in last because there's clearly no way I'm making this up. So. Okay. You're last. Uh, no, 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 she's going third. <laughs> in the game. <laughs> all right, next round. All right. The penultimate round. Yeah. Yellow. Uh... Well, <laughs> hey Vital, hey what's up? I like games with tight money and nice art. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I like games with tight money. Yeah. Uh, all right, so we're gonna go ahead and run some green. So we have the big twelve: one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Twelve is gonna get me to that. And then we also are running this bad boy, which is one, two, three, four, five, six, which is only one, 
but that'll go there, which means this now can come over here, and I'll take $35. And to answer your question, Ryan, this guy, at least at this moment, <laughs> right now, there we go. And completed my contract. Whew. It's done. No, no more red cubes for you. Right. At least this year. At least right now. Okay. So what are we doing here? That seems so unreasonable. <laughs> this is brutal. <laughs> yeah, that's the whole reason move to Boston is so it's not so late for VTOL to tune in. That's really the <laughs> You're real welcome, reason. Right, VTOL. yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> so what you thinking? Uh, I'm thinking I'm going to go to the crude market. Lay them down. Looks like so. I'm going to buy this for five. Which And I will also take my second reaction for free to take two pipes from here. There's so that's no 20. need to rub that in. Well, look <laughs> at me. I get two. Yeah. Maybe a secondary reaction. I don't care about orange. <laughs> You're take, dead to me. Yeah. Take that. I'll take that. Well done. So what's that run? One, two, three. Four, five, six. No one went for the nice. upgrade. Seven. Oh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. You're right. Yeah. Seven and uh, and the other big one. Nice. Okay. Cool. All right. Uh, so you changing turn order? Uh, yes, I am. You didn't have to. Just saying. Well, you reminded me of it. <laughs> it's twice. All right. Once for you. Once for Jess. Speaking of which, you're up. Yep. Team player, Vital. Anything for friends. <laughs> it's nice to see you, Doug. Mm -hmm. 16, 27. We don't really have space for three. Oh! Hello. Um, just tank space issues. Trying to determine. And tanks have gotten expensive. Uh huh. But they do get paid back, right? 10 for yeah. each. So. Yep. They're still technically free if you have the money to put out. Um, that's the problem. Either way, it doesn't, it takes a turn. So. Yes, Horace, you got it right. When you go to machines and pipes, you can buy machines in the eight, well, now there's only four pipes here. And when you go to tanks and pipes, you can go to tanks and buy these eight as well. Yeah, this was a hell of a day for a Kickstarter between this, yeah. City of the Big Shoulders. Yeah. Yep. Oh, if I run it, then I could do that for 10. Whew. It's a long day for you, Vince. It doesn't matter. Not enough moves left. Okay. Um, I'm going to go sell this then. 55 over there, market three. All right. Selling that bad boy for 55. Mm -hmm. All right. Anything else? No. Buying any orange? I guess not looking at that. Mm -mm. Going last still, I assume? Mm hmm. All right. Yep, you got it. And I need to. Or a third, sorry, I should say. I need to fulfill this contract. Hey, Cormac. Good seeing you. So. I will do gray, and it's one big long pipe. It's 18, mm -hmm. so I can complete. Yep, it goes all the way to, to high grade oil. And I will start to fulfill this contract to get some cash. That's 45 bucks. It's $45. And I am done. All right, new round. Final round of the second year, guys. The way this is going, this is going to come in right at about two hours of actual play time, which that is interesting. A half nope. an hour per play. Nobody's gotten machines. Not yet. No. That one. Emphasis on the yet. Mm-hmm. 
So I'm going to run both the greens. Yep. Okay. So one, two, three, four, five. Whatever. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Right. That's there. Yep. And the other green is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's there. Yep. So I'll fulfill these two. Here. Right. Yep. And that gets you how much? So, so forty bucks? Yep. Hey Dustin. I'm done. All right. Well, I am tempted by a machine, I'm not going to lie. Yeah, I think I have to. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, I have to. So we're going to tanks and machines. Or, or... So, mm -hmm. and I get to block it off for the year. Granted, it's not a whole lot. No, it's right now. For the upgrades, or do I want more pipe? Basically, do I want to take machines here, or do I want more pipe? More pipe could be really beneficial. One, two, three, four, five, six. I need four more. One, two, three. That would, uh, they would be too expensive. Yep. So, we're... We're going to go to upgrades. So I'll go ahead and pay 20 bucks and I will take the machines. So I will get one machine there. And during the work phase, I can place my worker on a machine that I own to run it at no cost if I want. Um, so I will take a machine. There you go. And this bad boy is going to go right her there so that means these are unavailable and are you buying just one upgrade uh, I would be two bucks short to be able to run my machine if I bought a second one so yes I am only buying one I'll go there block that one off that way Andrew can't smoke us by uh, but can you run it yeah for free. You, I can place phase. my worker. Okay. Right. Oh, as an action. Right. Oh, that's right. To that's run it for action. free. Yeah. Um, so I will go first. Go first off. And then for during now, we actually, there's actually a machine. So we go into the machine phase for the yes. first time at the end of my turn. So all of this runs. <laughs> so obviously Perfect. the silver is not doing anything, but no. the orange is doing one, two, three, four, five, six, which means the orange that's only going one, and then the green is going one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, which means hmm, that's kind of interesting. I think I will go there. And remember, it's going straight from crude to mid grade. So I I'm not even don't using the space. low grade. Okay, so I don't need that. Boom. And you that cost me 15 yeah. bucks, that's right, to run my, all my machines. And the turn of the yellow player is complete. Jess, you're up. Mm -hmm. Hey, Banker Dave, here too. Yay, all right, awesome. I'm going to go to the market. Can you push me a little further, sorry. And get... Two green and a gray. It's getting expensive, ain't it? No. $22. VTOL says, yeah, I also kickstarted Barrage, and now this one, I need to design more games to be able to afford <laughs> kickstarters. <laughs> that's good. I'm glad. Uh, that's awesome. And are you doing the secondary, Jess? Mm -mm. All right. So Jess is staying third. And bring us home. Andrew. I really wanted to buy a machine, but I cannot afford to do... 
It's almost like money's tight in this. Four, five, six, seven, oh, eight, congrats, eight, Shark. Ten, Glad to hear it. 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. <laughs> but I have to get... Ryan, good. I'm getting some of the money back I spend on all your games, beats all. <laughs> uh, and, uh, That's awesome. I think I know the answer to this, but you, okay. have, you have to place a machine on your existing Correct. It must cover half of an existing tile, like what I did. So, for instance, yeah, because you guys can see this, I couldn't do this, put it on the table, for instance, Correct. up there. No, it shortens your it pipeline shortens your by pipeline. one. Okay. Correct. So I will just... Uh, because I want to make sure I fulfill my contract, I will do the yep. same thing I did last turn and immediately 45 bucks. sell it for 45 bucks. And that's my turn. All right. End of the year. We go into the refresh phase again. All right. So no contracts over here. Everything slides over. All the contracts come out. Good call on that. Uh, the markets refresh. All of those, all of those, all of those. Oh, wow. Everything actually refreshes all the way full. Oop, one, These two, get there. discarded. Correct. Sorry. I can fill from here because my contract. Sure, yeah. Empty. And everybody fulfilled the. Oh, well, we'll get there. You can't. Everybody. But Jess. So Jess is going to get one penalty cube for her yeah. contract, and the contract goes away out of the game. Ah, oh, that's right. So on the good side, you don't have that. Except waiting. I'm all <laughs> primed for it. Right. Yeah. So there's that. And up there. So we assist contracts. We discarded contracts. Am I forgetting anything? Market we supply. That. Oh, tanks. Empty and, we, and refill we shops. Okay, yep. Please. And reset upgrades, which we already did. So four turns, yikes. Yep, and that's it. So do these go away? One more time. Okay, good call. This one stays. One green goes away here. Both the grays go away, and that one goes away as well. So what you see is what you get. Oh, we need one machine there. Boom, done. Okay, so these empty as well. And turn order. So I am first. Mm -hmm. Wow. Well, first things first, I'm going to move this over to my contract that's now empty. So 35 bucks for that, which I desperately need to be able to do what I want to do. So there's 35. I'm going to go up to the crude market, please. You are yellow. And I will get... Two... I will get three, question mark, one, and there. I'm getting two green. I think there might be a third. Give me just a moment for... Where I really have punted on silver, haven't I? Um, I know I'm getting at least one orange. Am I? Am I getting one orange? Uh, you know what? No, give me two more blue, or two more green, sorry. So what is that? That's 18 and 14, that's 32 bucks. Yeah, 32. There. So there. Yeah. So there's 32 bucks for that. Then another 15 to run my machine. Leaving me with six bucks. So running my machine, we're doing green goes to there for that. And the orange goes up one more, which will... 
go to that and this guy will immediately come over and get me 35 bucks done it's the end you of the yellow the machine string. then i thought you had to wait till the machine goes that i did that's okay. that was the end yep okay. and yellow isn't changing turn order okay black you're up there we go what you thinking um i'm gonna buy the um the five the okay how many one yeah one that's fine and let's see do we want to take an upgrade I'm miserable and having a blast being miserable <laughs> floundering, I feel like, over here. Yeah, let's take this guy for 20 bucks. This one? Yeah. You level one? Yep. Okay. So, this, oops. You see me rolling. The is done. So that's done for the year yep. or for the game. Yeah. And uh, let's cover up. Uh, What's this one? What's this one say? This is immediately received two tanks and one shot pipe from either shop. And yearly doesn't matter because we're in year three at this okay. point. So I will cover that. And my reason for thinking, reason of thinking for that is basically we've got end game scoring for yep. tanks. Yeah, it's 20, 20 points, so, right? 20 bucks. All right. So do I get this now? If it, the immediately you so, get. Yes, I do. Which obviously the Just, new, yeah. new uh, quadrant is open for business, right? So I know I asked this earlier, but since things have changed up a little bit, and let me let me show folks this real quick. Uh, there, so uh, Gorav covered those up. So, and we're talking about the end game scoring for those guys. Okay, there we go. Um, I know I asked it earlier, but is it making sense? Are you guys able to follow along, even if you know maybe the strategy we're not playing the greatest? Not named Andrew, but. Uh, <laughs> But, uh, yeah. yeah, hopefully it's making sense for y'all. So you went to where again? I went there, took that, and got different right. pipes. And upgrade or uh, turn order? Turn Anything going on? Yeah, I'll go first. I'll be taking first. Um, I'm okay with that now. I don't mind going to the. It's all right for me to take my government tile first. Yeah. It, yep. Absolutely. In fact, that's one. Uh, that it triggers no, immediately. You got it. Thank you. And that is for that. Yes. Uh, the your upgrade, upgrade that yep, I have my export. Yearly. Um, and I'll take my meeple. How do we reach that? <laughs> go go gadget on. Right, right? seriously. Yeah. I cannot. All right, um, just running some orange, pipes. But I get to run the silver and that. Yep. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten now. Wait, yep, that gets you up to level two, yes. up to mid grade. Not that I need that, but I will. And then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Seven, well done. Eight. Well done. Hey. If nothing else, it's impressive, I, I, right? <laughs> close to filling your orders. Yeah. Is there anything there? Nope. Not yet. Not yet, but all in due time. There's not a lot of time, is there? <laughs> there is, a, hence that, that due time comes quick, A right? due time, not, right, not, so not, a, not enough So she stays third. And Andrew. All right, so I'm going to go to the crude market. No, uh, real quick, let me, let me pause you for a second. To answer your question, Adam, so what I did, I took my turn, and then at the end of my turn is machine phase. I can then pay $15 to run my machines, which is what I did. I think I'm going to run a machine here, so Okay, if that so helps. yeah, there you go. Okay. I'm going to try to, at least. So I'm going to go to the crude market first and buy two oranges for 10 And then... A 10 for the secondary? A gray for six. Oh, sorry. 
and I'll pay 11 to get 5 back. And yes, I am going to be doing 10 for a secondary, and I'm going to be buying a machine. 20 there. bucks for that, and 15 to run it when it becomes... Do you want me to break, no, no, break it fine, out? You're like? You're, no, you're fine. So, uh, so it's going to be a total of 35. Yeah, so it's 20 to buy it and place it. And I think I remember where I was going to place it. One, two, three, four, five, six, and then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Okay. All right, cool. So that now you mess with turn order? So my turn order, I'm going to choose to go last. Okay, so now, or technically it would go machine go phase, machine then turn phase. order. So it goes to your, your machine phase. You pay the 15 bucks, which you already did, and you run your machine. So I'm going to run this pipe for one, two, three, four, five, six which is enough to upgrade one gray. Yep. I'm going to run this orange for one, two, three, four, five, six, which is enough for one orange. Then I'm going to run this one for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, which is enough for two gray. There we go. So. Boom. So that's how the machine phase works. That's the end of the round. We go into the second round of the third year. Shift those. And go, Rob, you're up. Oh, I forgot one thing. Take care, Clef. Have a good night. What's up? I don't think it's super important, but... Oh, you should have been able to take your time. I yes. Yep. I was just going to... I don't think this... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It doesn't change anything. Okay, cool. All right, go, Ralph. So Adam was asking that. So isn't the machine phase, though, after? You could have taken an action to run it, but you didn't place your worker on it and take the action to do it. Otherwise, right, so I paid 15 bucks. No, so... You, every player on their turn has a work phase, then a machine oh, phase. Oh, it's on each player's turn. It is. Okay. All right. So every player has a work phase, then it goes into machine this phase. This is what Adam thought on. as well. There it you go. after the end of a full okay. round, not at the nope, end of a player's nope, turn. No, no, no. At the end of each player's turn. Okay. There you go. No, no worries. No, I, other people may have had the same question. I might not have explained that real clearly. So right. no, no so worries. go here and run our network. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six. For silver, which is one. Yep. And this one, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. It's five. So that's that. These two come over here for 40 bucks. Yep. Cool. Done? Mm hmm. All right. Uh, so I'm up. And I had a plan, stay on target, <laughs> stay on target. That was it. I'm going to contracts and loans, not taking a loan, but I will take that top center contract. Yep. And I will not defer that. I will go ahead and take it. <laughs> you can. Now. <laughs> right, exactly. Um, actually, I can now... Go ahead, bring that bad boy over, which that's going to get me 20 bucks for there. And more importantly, it now gives me three levels for the valuation on that. Um, do I want to go to the crude market? I don't, don't think I do. Yeah, so that's the end of my turn. I'm going to change turn order so that I will go... Hmm. Fifteen, nope. I'm, uh, do I have a reason to do anything as far as turning turn order over for me? I don't, but I'll go first, just in case, and then I will pay 15 bucks to run my machines. This is going to move up to there, and again, running, sorry, running the same green, which goes there, which this is going to come over to that immediately and get me 35 bucks. And done. 
Hmm. All right. Well, just to illustrate how tight money is in this game and poor planning doesn't pay off, if I had more money, I could go and try to get some of these in-game scoring things by doubling up on my turn, going to, like, tanks and getting some tanks that will double their value at $5, getting paid 10 at the end. Or go it's to like machines a group on for and run. <laughs> yeah, group on for that. That did happen today. Um, or run or have the machines and the values attached. But again, I don't have enough money to do that. So all I'm going to do is go to Refine Market Two okay. and pay twelve dollars for these guys, and that will be it. And so Jess stays third. Mm -hmm. And Andrew, quick question: the value of the leftover. Oil? If you look on your plate here, um, yeah. If you look right here, the oil barrels, any barrels that are left on your tableau, they're actually going to score twice because of. Hold on. They're gonna actually score twice because mm -hmm. this here, the value of refined oil tanks, they're actually worth sixty, forty, and twenty respectively. Just okay. that just so happened to be what what valuations that came out. All right. So the first thing I'm going to do, I assume I can do this before I take yep. an action. Is you can fulfill that for twenty twenty dollars. Thanks, Craig. I appreciate it. And then tanks and pipes. Refine market two. What so you thinking? I'm thinking. I, I was actually thinking of getting these because they are worth increase uh, of five bucks. Right? It's yeah, it's five dollars a piece. But then the other option is buying and trying to refine more oil. Uh, <laughs> and I think. I'm going to try and actually refine some more oil. All right. Um, so I'm going to buy a gray for six and an orange for seven. So one, two, and another orange for... Twenty. No, actually, I'll buy a, a, a gray. Twenty-one. So twenty-one dollars. And you grab me four dollars, Jess. Mm -hmm. and, and then my turn is over. I will retain my turn order, but I go to the machine phase where I will run my machine. And it is the same as last turn, so it's going to be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Four. So it's that's a um, one single silver, one double silver. So I could do this orange. to uh, here. Yep. Uh, and then this one is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, um, which can get me to here. Uh, right here. Yep. And then and orange then as well. Orange is going to be 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, which is still only enough for 1. Yeah, that was actually really good because you were already at level one at the low level for mm -hmm. the gray. So it only cost you eight to make it all the way to the high level. That was well done. Good okay. call. And I can sell this at, at any time. Or fulfill the fulfill contract. Fulfill my contract right. for $45. Yep. And, my and that's it for turn order. And we are on the penultimate turn of the game. Okay. Um, it's actually worth 60 bucks for that. To let it sit. And that's worth more than actually selling it. So it makes sense to hold on to it. Uh, one there. Gets me to there. I'm going to... Really? Is that what I'm going to do? I guess so. Uh, not terribly exciting. Find market three, buy these for 14 bucks. Mm. 
And do I want to go to contracts and loans? I really don't think I do at this point. Because I don't have time to do the gray. So it doesn't make sense for me to do that. I would like to. <laughs> I really would. And same with the... Because uh, that would potentially be worth one, two, three. That would be worth 90 bucks if I could complete that contract. But I can't get the gray. And I don't see you people selling it out here. That'd be great. I'd be willing to do that. <laughs> um, so I think I'm, I'm done other than running my machine. So I'm going to run my machines again. So it's going to be a double for the green. And then it's going to be a single for an orange. And done. All right. Gora? So I'm going to go to the fine market one. I'm going to buy these two. Mm -hmm. 12 bucks. So that's five and seven. Let's go there. And as a free trade. Yep. 20 bucks for the machine. Oh no. For the machine? <laughs> yep. I had great plans. <laughs> right. It's funny how Hashtag it had. <laughs> Yeah, Would you right. like to block anything else off? <laughs> Would you? It just seems petty, and it does. I totally support that because yeah. I wasn't. Yeah, yeah. I was and at then I press the machine. This one. Yeah, it'd be nice. It'd be really nice. I don't know. It's perfect. <laughs> Brian says something. It's a testament to the game design that it came in an hour and a half late. Yet this still makes perfect sense picking things up halfway with no teach. Mm. That bodes well. Yeah. And well, it's the layout and design, too, that That's right. yeah, it is pretty really clear. Help. Oh, wait. Now it is. Now <laughs> it's all clear. There we go. All much better. All right. Yeah. That doesn't help. Yeah, and I'll figure this out. All right, you're changing anyway. turn order? Uh, are you? Yeah. Are you? No. Okay. No, and then you're going to run your machine I once will. you figure it out, right? Okay. okay. For that. I'm going to run my machine. Just or run your network, right? My network. Okay. Sorry. It's personal right. pipe network. No, just it's for the personal, folks at home. It is, That's it all. is. Yeah. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So that brings me up here. Funny thing is, there were, there were so much unsold. That it I already did the math on that. Yeah. No, there's another way to go. Oh, is there? Okay, goes. I'm excited. See what you do. It's not <laughs> enough, but it's a thing. And you ran yours, so just yes. stays third. Andrew, you're up. So I have two turns left. Yes. And that is it. This, and then I'll come back to you. Run the machine for one, two, three. It's not about oil markets. Four, five, it's about six, refining seven. oil, Vince, so I would argue. I'm going to yeah. sell this orange six. again to make sure I complete this contract. 20 bucks. 20 bucks. And then... I am going to um, Oh, and there's something while Andrew's thinking, something I wanted to show you guys on this also is the tanks and pipes. If you wanted to have it on these so it's not sideways like this, it actually on the other side goes to where they're 180 out like that to where it switches or 90 degrees, I guess it were. Yeah. I mm -hmm. thought that was a clever little yeah, graphic little design that nice. Ian did. Yeah. So because it's getting a little late, <laughs> and I just want to make sure if I run this from here. Yep. Uh, I run the whole tile. Now here's the th here's mm -hmm. the thing to keep in mind. However, you do run the whole tile for anything that isn't connected to a machine. Otherwise, only right. the machines will run it. That's right. That's right. So you would only run the orange. Yes, in that instance. In that instance, because both the silver are connected to the seven. machine. Right. Machines okay. are hugely beneficial, but they can get in your way. But they're limiting mm -hmm. also, right? Yeah, because it keeps you from being able to do exactly what... And it they, splits, and you have to give up half. that real estate. Yes. They do? Exactly. I know. Yeah. So one thing Ryan was telling me when we were going over the rules of this uh, uh, yesterday, a couple of days ago, whatever it was, that there's different layers to planning the pipelines. There's, oh, just trying to get stuff to fit together. 
then it's trying to plan where you're going to put your worker. And then the third level is anticipating where you're going to place your machines right. while you're building your pipelines. Yeah. And it gets even trickier when you plan to have more than one machine. Right. Oh, yeah. If okay. So I'm going good luck. to... Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm not there yet. No. I'm going to take tanks and pipes and okay. buy the tanks. Seems greedy. Okay. And... Then, oh, that makes no sense to do that. Uh, I can also buy two of those for 15. Yep. Which I will do. Get 20 back, and you will have paid for your machines. For my machines. So uh, I'm just, I'll run my machine, and then I'll figure this out in okay, a second. Sure. Yeah, uh, there's your 20 bucks oh, back. Oh, thank you. All right, so um, your turn's done, but one, you're going to purchase three, two four, of them. Five, six, seven, eight. So I can go... Um, just one. one. Yeah, one either way. So that'll, I'll go one there. And then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. I'll go two here. And then the orange is going to be just, yep, just one. Just one. All right. All right. And, and it's going to be from here. So. You're, you're staying in fourth? Yes. All right. Final round. Mm -hmm. While Andrew decides on his pipes. So my final action, I need to make sure I don't screw this up. So here's what I'm thinking, that if I want this to be worth anything, I have to actually go there and run it. One, two, three, four, five. Or, or I spend $30, $45 to get a machine. $45, that would only pay me 20 to do that. And it just doesn't make sense. Mm -hmm. Really? That's so anticlimactic. Is that really what I'm going to do? I guess that's what I'm going to do. I have to. So, I'll go there, but I cannot run the orange because it's hooked up to a machine. So, I will just run one, two, three, four, five. Really? Is that the best I can do? That's going to be worth 20 bucks. Ugh. All right, fine. I will do that. Then I will spend $15, getting five back, to run my machine. Running my machine runs now the orange and the green. The green will go two jumps to there for 10. And the orange will go there. And because this, there, that'll become 45 bucks, make it a 50 and the game of the yellow player is complete. I'm done. Yeah, it doesn't matter on turn order. <laughs> All right. Hey, Felix. Oh, good point. Ryan says, remember, things attached to machines are worth more money on the in-game valuations. Yep. That is a good point. But nope, I'm good with it. I'm done. I'm going to stick with it. All right, so, Gorov, you're up. I'm actually getting the uh, the actual rules on that one real quick. So, uh, Edward. Yes. I can still run this pipe, but again, not through the machine, correct? I mean, I can still go here. No, it's connected to the machine, so you cannot go there. Oh. Uh, well, you can go there, but you can't run that one. Well, I can go here then because of this. There you go, right, to yeah. do it for free. Right. And then I jump both of them up. Mm-hmm. Uh, one, two... One, two, three, yep. four, five, six. Yep. One, two, three, four, five, six. Done? Yep. Yep. And that's it. All right, Jess. I'm going to run this again. This goes here. This goes here. And I can fulfill an order, which I 
get out of thing. Oh, was I adding that wrong? Oh, those are only. So there's this order. Okay. That's. You 90. can always do less. You can do that, yes. Y yes. I know I can, I have more, so I'm just going to add that up real quick. So that's 90, 135. I know that those are 60. 195. So 195 for that. Oh, that doesn't Plus, end up being hold worth on, it. Hold on, hold on. Plus, don't forget this. Uh, that's there gonna is that. It's going to get to another 30 bucks because nope, there's two No, it's still 225. These in yep. here score double. So this is 40 times 3, 120. And this is 60, so that's 300. So it's not worth it. Makes sense. All set. Okay. So what do you, oh, you ran your network as well. All right. And wow, go. all of us are running our own networks for the end. Interesting. Good to know, Felix. I'll be at BGGCon. All right. Shoot. That was a mistake. Oh, no. Uh, yes. Oh, I just saw uh, Aquinash. Aquinash. Hey, Aqua. <laughs> <laughs> So what are you thinking, Andrew? Well, I'm thinking I made a, a mistake. Uh, I was going to try and run this orange and this gray, but I cannot do that because they are not connected. Uh -huh. uh, this, yeah, they are. Over on the t second foot right there. But this is not. It's going to be this one. Oh, well. Yes. Yeah. I can't help you there. <laughs> yep. <laughs> so I can six. Oh, mm. Well, I think I'm going to just do that. One, two, three, four, five, six. So I can do that. Okay. And, and then, then 15, 15 to run for your my machine. Um, and so it's going to be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, which will be enough for a double upgrade. Yep. And then one, two, three, four. Well, it's enough for a double upgrade. Yep. And one of those completes your contract, right? Yes, for 40? 45. 45. Yeah. Touch. And then the orange goes 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, which is enough for another level. Yep. All right. And I don't think there are any... Uh, nope, I cannot. I... All right, so that's it. So there's the end of the game. So that is the end of the third year. We go into final scoring. So we'll do this step by step, one player at a time. So oil barrels right here score this. But because the value of refined oil in tanks, might as well do it all twice yeah. all at once. So everything is double. So it's 60, 40, 20. Um, we'll do it in player order, I guess. So for this one here, Put it here. There we go. So for that one, uh, so I have this is 60, that's 40, that's 100, 140 for my oil that's out there. So 140, please. Uh, make it 150. Yep. I'm done. And black, Gorov. All right. So this is 60, and this is 40, and another 40, so 140. Yep. 100's on the side. Yeah, right. Yeah, we haven't touched we, yeah, it. Uh, no, he doesn't have it. 140. And Jess? Um, 180 for these, 120 for these, so 300. Well Sorry. done. <laughs> That's more than I have. For that. It's like all I'm scoring. No, your pipelines are going to score you quite a bit. All right. So, then, so this would be 60 at the top? Yep. And then 40 for each one of these. So 100, 140, 180, 220. Okay, 220. Then, then we go into the pipeline. So, mm -hmm. so you start from as if you had crude, and then you look at each of your pipelines, and what can you get from it? So for me, I essentially have three pipelines that do worth a damn, honestly, that get me to at least the first level. So I have this orange, which is going to get me only to the... Uh, low grade, so I'm going to get 10, 
bucks for that orange. I'm going to get 10 bucks for this green. And this green is going to get me to the second level, which is 20. So it's going to be a total of 40 bucks. And I got another 10. There we go. Does that make sense? Mm -hmm. Yes. All right. Uh, Gaurav? All right. So um, I have... Um, oh, uh, Gaurav didn't, uh, didn't take money for his orange barrel because it's unrefined and you get no money for that, Adam. So one, two, three, four, five, six. So there's ten. Bu I got it. Ten, ten bucks for the orange. Then the that's one, two, three, four, five, six. It's that's another, another. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So that's another ten. Okay. And one, two, three, four, five, six. That's so, another. And I think that's pretty much it, I guess. And I th you got this guy there, right? I think one, I counted that. Two, one, two, three, three four. That's four, no. five. I count five. Uh, where? Okay, so you got one, two, three, four. four. Oh. Yeah. Four. Yep. Never mind. Forty bucks. I can, there we I go. Can so, yeah, it. yeah. I tried to get you an extra yeah, ten bucks. Jess? Just make this. Um, my green goes all the way, so thirty. Silver goes to this grade, so twenty. And orange goes to the first grade, which is ten. Sixty, so 60. bucks. Yep. Negative fifty from there. All right. All right. And so do multiple silvers yep. score? Okay. Yep. Everyone does. Yep. So this one's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, which will be ten. Is that? Yeah. So ten, so it's two it, levels, it so it's twenty bucks. No, it only gets to, it's, sorry, it was eight, so it gets oh, to one level. Correct. So ten bucks. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. That's so 30. 30. One, two, three, four, five, six. Forty. One, two, three, four, five, six. Fifty. One, two, three, four, five, six. Sixty. That's it. So sixty. Now, anybody that has machines, because of the actual tile, notice this one's a tile, it's thicker. So this one's in every game. The value, so you count anything that's hooked up to a machine again. So that's going to be another 10 and another 20 for me. So 30 more. I got it over here. I got 20. Okay, and there you go. That's me. Cool. All right, and no machine, and you have it's another... A, it's a one and a two, so 30. Uh, 40, and the orange. Oh, yes, yes. So 40 more for you. Thanks, Ryan. All right, so then we go into the valuations. Well, we've already done two of them. That one's pretty easy, 10 bucks for every tank. Two, four, seven, 70 bucks. 70. Can I get 100, please? I will also take a hundred. Twelve tanks. Gross. Yeah. A couple hundreds for this side of the table. I'm sorry, what did you need? Hundred. Hundred for each of us. Yep. Thank you. All right. Everyone do their tanks. Mm -hmm. And now we have number of refined oil tanks and fulfilled contracts and orders. So every by the way, everybody did fulfill all their orders, so nobody got any more uh Penalty cube. cubes, okay? So, to show this, these are mine. So I have three different levels in a color, so I have three of the possible nine, so that's gonna get me 60 bucks. Can I get a 50, please? Thank you. Okay. So I have two colors, so 20, or 30 bucks. Okay. But you have your... Yep, two. He's at two of the possible nine combinations. Right. But do, doesn't he get for the type of... No, it, yeah. it's, it, there are nine combinations, and he yeah, got he two, two of the two nine, of so he gets so how many 30 unique bucks. Ones it's not have. color and, so you're, he's yeah. that and that, and that's it. Yep. Okay. So and, So you have, in my, in my you case, have two. You have two. You have two types, so it's going to be 30 bucks $30. as well. And Jess uh, forwent mm. that. Yep. All right, minus your penalty cubes. So I have one, so I lose 20 bucks. I have one. Minus 20. Two, 50. Uh, read them and weep. What do you got? So I'm at 402 bucks. Oh. <gasps> By five bucks. I got you. So, Andrew uh, comes in and wins in his first game. So, Andrew <laughs> yeah. wins. 
Uh, I'm second, hashtag mediocre teacher. Uh, Jess in third, and Gaurav, uh, thanks for playing. Oh, yeah, it was a <laughs> uh, wow. All right. So, like I said, normally we don't do we don't do uh, roundtables for sponsored playthroughs. Mm -hmm. However, everyone knows I've been a big fan of this game, so I thought that it was all right to do so. So, all right. That side of the table. You guys are new to the stream, so this is your first play. I don't know what that says about us, honestly. But, <laughs> all right, so Andrew, what did you think about the game? Perfect teaching. Um, yeah, obviously, <laughs> right? Yes. It's, it's, it's interesting. The, the thing I was most concerned about coming into the stream was this mm -hmm. part of the game. The building your pipeline? Right, the yeah. spatial awareness uh, and what I had resigned to to do to hope to do was to focus on two colors because I figured if I added the third color it would add complexity that I wasn't sure I could handle okay um, so and it wasn't that bad I didn't spend a ton of time fitting the pieces it's not hard to identify what pieces will fit to make like obviously none of us were optimizing I don't get sure right. I, I don't think but yeah just ask uh, ask uh, <laughs> the chat ask, uh, yeah they, they I, I was brutalizing us right right um, one thing that occurred to me as we were playing is it seemed like there was a lot of the game that wasn't necessarily explored, and I'm wondering if that was just more of the game being uh, the way it worked out. Uh, we didn't have a ton of second level, third level upgrades, um, and uh, it could be just the way, like, our inefficiency. Right. And what, inefficiency one thing that I will, so when I talked to, when I was talking with Tim and Ryan about the game, and I said, essentially, and there is a little bit of crossover here, but essentially players usually either go for contracts and orders yeah. or and or sell to the refined market. Usually it's it's mostly focused on one of those. It just so happened that the majority of us uh all went for contracts mm -hmm. and didn't go refine markets as well. And that helps. It, it was kind of a little bit more homogenous as opposed to, I bet you if we sat and played it again, if if the other valuation wasn't out there that doubled the value of the, of the uh, oil that was in our tanks, yes. that would have changed. You would have been more inclined to sell so, to the refined market. Which is what well. I did the first time I played. So I played this before and I was very much like, there's money there. Let's grab that. And we're selling and selling and selling. So those events really do change yeah. what you do. Yeah. yeah. So I think it was just the way the valuations came out as well as, let's face it, we weren't maximizing the sure. way we were playing, right? Yeah. I, I, I feel that these have a tremendous impact on how the game plays. The valuation? Mm -hmm. Yes. Agreed. Okay. Yes. Because... I mean, I, I went there my first in during the first two years, and I got a lot of money out of it. But then I looked at, oh, I'm not doing so well on the end game scoring, mm -hmm. so I need to kind of switch gears or pivot to doing to concentrating on that. Sure. Um, I ended up getting three of these, which I don't know if if it's optimal or if something if I played badly, which I right. did. Well, <laughs> let's not get into that. But right. Um, but I think this has got a tremendous amount of replayability. Mm -hmm. Just in there's like there's randomness in the setup and randomness in the end game scoring, which yeah. which is part of setup. It is yeah, right. Yeah, yeah, but, yeah, yeah right. Um, so, I mean, I just I love it. So how about you? You were you were not a huge fan of the spatial aspect coming into the game. It's not that I'm not a fan of it. It breaks my brain. Yeah. But I love games like that because it's it gives me an opportunity to kind of keep practicing that. Maybe someday I'll be good at it. I'll keep trying. Um, so no, it wasn't that I wasn't a fan of it. But the first few times I played, I really focused. And this being a replay, I was like, oh, well, let me try a whole bunch of different things. And that didn't work out for me as well because it didn't optimize the moves that I was making. And it let me fall short on a few things. If I could have gotten a machine, if I had gone for some of those things. And I just didn't optimize that because I was kind of all over the place with what I was going for. So it changed how I played too, as you said, with the valuations that impacted um, the gameplay as well, but no, I have enjoyed it every time I've played it. Yep, and I'm a huge fan of it. Uh, I have been for better part of two years now and was really excited to be able to show this off and to honestly to play it a bunch before mm -hmm. the stream and on yeah. the stream because 
we like to play games, and yeah. this yeah. is fun. This is, uh, this even is though fun. I feel like I did terribly in a sense that, I mean, there was something obvious that everybody and their mother apparently saw that I didn't. <laughs> um, but it just goes to show that I struggle with the spatial aspect horribly yeah. about this. But it's kind of like you that it makes me more eager to want yeah. to keep exercising no, kind of like a muscle like right. i'm yeah. like i'm going to get I'm gonna I'm gonna get gonna better it out. <laughs> and i think that's i think that's a sign of a good game and yeah. i love also it's a little thing but these can change up where they are yeah. so maybe oh. this game you know you maybe this, it ends up i mean it's a small here. thing but it's it adds here. to that that variability well it changes with one of the bit. powers out here too right that you can get cuz you can do an adjacent right sequence. and yeah. another thing that the guys told me is don't let one person yeah. race up oh, this yeah. because, yeah. because these level 3s get to be super powerful right mm -hmm. and i think we did a pretty good job of blocking it yeah of yeah. blocking each other off on that right. but if you don't like the idea of blocking off the second one then don't include it type thing right um, so overall, I'm curious. Oh, I, I think I know, but did you enjoy I, I, it? I backed it this morning, yes. Yeah. <laughs> <Okay. laughs> yes. uh, I, en I enjoyed it quite a bit. And, and one of the things, I, I really, the dynamic markets, uh, for some reason, I, I just find that mecha mechanism, like, it's just very satisfying. Mm -hmm. and yep. You get that, right. that passive level of interaction yeah. that you really feel. And I think I benefited in this game by the fact that a lot. You guys were all fighting over green, whereas yes, I, your diversification uh, I involved. had, I was fortunate that I focus on gray and silver. Yeah. The other thing I would say is a positive for the game is, uh, is yeah. the flow of the game was very good. Uh, there was not a lot of downtime. You're thinking when it's not your turn, so it, I never felt like I was, you know, looking at my phone waiting for my turn no. to come. Yeah. Um, because the game is, it, it keeps moving, and once you get, I would say, there's a very good rhythm to the game. Right? Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, that's a good way to put it. I, I feel like we didn't interact as much with the chat because the no. turns are relatively quick, yes. and you're so focused on the game to where I'm like, I only got a few actions in between my turn, and so okay, I'm here. Oh wait, it's back to my turn, right. and now I feel like I'm I'm slowing everything down because of that, which again, like kind of goes back to what you were saying that there's just not a lot of downtime no there's no this. if anything it came back and i was like oh i'm not ready <laughs> right and todd kind of said what you just said the fact that andrew didn't go for green while everybody yeah. else was competing yeah. for it yeah. benefited and i think if we were to sit down and play this again right now we collectively wouldn't We'd allow that to happen no, right no, yeah. we so. i mean if we let him run away with all the oranges yes right. for sure Yep. So I mean, I tried true. to get you got in, in there on at the end, but it was bit, late. But yeah. yeah. So I mean, this this just feels it like this has like got a vital game it feel kind, to it. it yeah, see, I yeah. could see that. Yeah, to yeah. where I mean, you have one worker. Yeah. Right, and yeah. go do something. Yeah. 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 yeah, I could see that. So honestly, well done, Ryan, and yeah. everybody yeah. else involved in this. Yeah. I, I think. backed it this morning as well. <laughs> I actually was. I got up. I knew the Kickstarter was, Kickstarter was going live this today. I got up, immediately checked my phone if it's <laughs> oh, nice. if it's live, uh, but yeah. then went home, went back to went to work and then backed it from there. So Good. And, and Ryan's a New Hampshire guy, right? No, Ryan's in New, New York, York actually. Okay. He's in yeah. NYC. I think Tim. I can't remember where Tim is, who's the developer. Clay is in Dayton, Ohio, yeah. and Ian's obviously in Australia. So that's yeah. kind of the crew yeah. there. Yeah, and um, we, didn't, we didn't even really talk about the art because it, I think one of the good signs of of quality art and graphic design is you don't it doesn't get in the way of the oh, gameplay. Not at, at all. no point. And, no. Is, and it's super clean. I and mean, it just enhances it. Yeah, it really. Right. And so here, something I wanted to show. So the the three tiles, those are all on the back that yes. matches up to that. The fours match up. The backs of those match up with what mm -hmm. those are. Yep. But I'll be honest, and I think this. This shows how spoiled I feel like we've gotten a little bit that I expect this from Ian. Yeah. Um, yeah. And when I interviewed Ian, uh, Ian O'Toole, the graphic design and artist, he had said that he actually play tests his graphic design. Like, oh, will this stack of chits impact somebody from being able to see that side of the board mm -hmm. or stuff like that? And that's, right. yeah, that amazes me. So, yeah, well done all the way around. Yeah. And, and some people were saying earlier in the chat that this board looks a lot overwhelming yes at the start it does and it 
Probably does just because of the sheer amount of pipes. That <laughs> In the right. Yeah. Right. Yeah. yeah. Right. right. Um, and they were also saying something about setup, and you mentioned that oh, this, you know, separating this into right. yeah. different types adds some time to it. But it's really a question of how you store them. You can just store the ones with this bag. Yeah, and baggies. From yeah, yeah, yeah. I baggies. mean, it came all together too. And you said when you first set it up, wow, that that was surprisingly not smooth. Hard. Yeah, yeah, yeah I mean, agreed. And we set it up the other day before on on. On game day, and this didn't take a lot of time. At no, all. no, it really, it didn't. really doesn't. On, on screen chat windows. Uh, oh, okay. Sorry. Um, they updated it. Sorry, guys. Nothing. Oh, yeah, it died. So there goes chat. Sorry, guys. <laughs> YouTube's uh, doing some updates. Yeah, it happens. So anyway, that said, um, so yeah, I assume you really enjoyed yes, it. Yes, I right? do. So okay. yeah, and I obviously am a huge fan of it. So there you go. So again, big thanks to Clay over at Capstone, both for sponsoring and for providing us with the prototype. Again, even though it's a really high-end prototype, remember, it's a prototype, guys, so keep that in mind. Uh, keep an eye on the Kickstarter to understand what's going to change uh, graphic design-wise, if anything, as well as components. Um, and again, uh, thank you and congrats to Ryan, Tim, Ian, Clay, everybody involved in the process. Yeah. Well done. It was a really, really good game. Yeah. Really enjoyed it. Just get it to us as soon as possible. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, please. yeah right? Uh, so, yeah, there you go. Um, don't forget, like, subscribe the video. It helps the channel very much. Also, if you want to become, join the 741 patrons, as well as the folks that are at this table, really would appreciate the support over on PledgeHC.com. That said, uh, this is on Kickstarter for, I think, another four weeks, yes, uh, something like that. Yeah, I think. 27 days. Yeah. Okay, cool. So check it out over on Kickstarter. The link is, will be down below, and if not, the mods can add it to the uh, chat, okay? So, again, I'm Edward. Jess. Andrew. Gaurav. Y'all have a wonderful night, and we'll see you Thursday for Barrage. Bye. Take care, everybody. <laughs>